Hello, can you guys hear me? I'm I'm working on my screen. Bear with me. Hello. I cannot see what the Okay. Right. There. Okay. I think I almost got it. Uh, I almost got it. What's up everybody? Sorry. Huh? Huh? I think that works. Look at that. Oh, no, no, it does not. It does not work. There it is. No, no. No, no. I think that works. Ah, I think that works. Let's hope it does. Hello, everyone. Hello. I'm setting up Wasteland 3, new game. You guys know how it is with new game. These things take time. Um, good morning, good morning, good morning. Hello, everybody. Welcome. It's a new game day. Yes, it is. Ty5 is here. Nice and early. What's up, Matt? What's up, Sarah? Let's see. What did I miss? RJ is here, and everyone's saying good morning to him. He wasn't first, though. Just going to say. Just going to throw that out there. Just gonna put that out there. Uh, who me? Sorry for starting a little later. I do have my coffee. Oh goodness! There we go. Sorry, I start. Sorry, I I kind of panicked and and just hit go live because I was like I couldn't get my. Um, resolution to work right. It is now, for the record, but I couldn't get it on the game and I was panicking, so I just hit go live and and here we are. Here's the mug of the day. Ah, uh, yes. How was Sound of Silence last night? Was I able to sleep? Yes! Here's the thing. I don't enjoy, the, I don't really consider a game like that very scary in a sense, in the same sense that I consider phasmophobia scary. I had a much harder time sleeping after phasmophobia because it forced my brain to like be in that mode more. Whereas with this, this game, so here's the thing. This game is in beta, that signs of silence. It's another horror game. A lot of people are playing it. Um, Steph loves horror games, of course. Um, but it's still in beta, meaning it's not done and People, I think a lot of times people who, if you're not used to like what actually playing a game in early access or in an open beta is like, it can be misleading sometimes because there's games that are really well done that are in an op early access, right? And you're like, you'd never know it. But someone said, oh, it's early access. This is not one of those games. This is one of those games where it's like, okay, we're barely, we're playing on what is a barely functional game right now. Barely. Meaning we could walk around in, in, in the game world and not crash every five seconds. Um, but as far as like the rules and what you can do and what you can't and what makes it scary and what doesn't, like none of it worked. I kept telling the girls, I'm like, it's supposed to be a stealth game. The name of the game is Signs of Silence. Like we need to be quiet. We need to just sneak and just be quiet. And then we tried and then they still just like teleport in front of you and murder you. And I'm like, that's not fun that doesn't like I want to like I don't know guys I don't just live to like it's not fun I do not understand why people think it's fun to just get scared I'm like I don't understand it's to me there's like there's no appeal to it so it's it's just like pure sugar it's pure waste it's 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 just a it's just nothing filler it's like oh, okay cool like I got scared now what I'm like what did I gain from that nothing like, it wasn't even a good scare. It wasn't even, like, a legit scare. It literally teleported in front of me. That's not fair. 
Like, I don't know, you guys, I'm way too much of a gamer. When the game, when I'm like, this is not fair and it's broken and like whatever, I just don't. I'm like, meh. Like, it, it has potential. This is what I will say. The game has potential. And I'm completely okay having given them $15 to continue working on the game. That's what it costs. That's fine. I'm 100% okay with that. That's what early access is supposed to be. They offer you the game for a cheaper price. You, you contribute, and then they can continue working on the game and developing it and updating it, and hopefully one day get to a really good game. So I'm fine with that, but I had my fill. Um, but it wasn't really scary. Like, it didn't scare me like that. It, it Like, I don't know, just once I realized that they were just going to teleport in front of me anyway, I stopped getting scared. There was no tension, you know? I, I scream like I do in Phasmophobia because I can literally hear them, like, walking up behind me and then grabbing me. Like, it's horrifying. That was just like... Meh. Like, nah, whatever. Like, just because I'm like, ugh. Nah, it's not the same. It's not the same. Stealth the game. Shayna running. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, we would surely kill each other if we were lost out in the woods together. That I can be certain of at this point. Yeah, Shayna had no desire to stealth inside the game. At all. So, it was fun. It was worth the video. It was always, it's always fun to play stuff with the BRE. But, the game's got a long way to go. And, when it comes to horror, I'm going to be playing more Phasmophobia. And, I'm also going to be playing, what's it, uh, Little Hope, I think, with Steph, as it gets closer to Halloween. That's why she wanted to play with me. Um, it's my it's made by the same people that made Man of Medan, which we played together, and I think you guys liked a lot. That was a good horror game. Like good tension, good storytelling, good build up. Like I I don't know, I need a little more than just a jump scare. Like So I'm looking forward to that. She would get scared just she gets scared if she just thinks she sees anything. She scared me so badly one time <clears throat> playing Phasmophobia, just screaming at a shadow, like a shadow of herself. Um, and even I could see it was a shadow, but she was holding the camera, and so it was casting this weird shadow where, like, the legs of the camera looked like a big monster on the wall. <laughs> so I could kind of see it, but she, it scared me so bad. Um... Angel watched the part two of Among Us with the BRE and Up, Up, Down, Down. Oh, yeah. It's so good. Speaking of Among Us, by the way, I know we, I know you guys have been watching what's on Up, Up, Down, Down. However, um, today I would like to release part three of my Among Us stuff, which is when we play with the BRE and Friends. We have already two episodes out of that on my channel, and I have a third one that is ready to go up. And I have one of the funniest clips, I cannot wait to post it, one of the funniest clips ever from that game that I cannot wait to post with it. So um, today on my channel, make sure you guys keep an eye out, I will be putting that up to premiere as well. It's not live, remember? It's not live. We recorded it like two weeks ago, and it just we edit it, and then I premiere it. Because no one has seen my perspective, and it's a new thing. So it's a premiere, so that you guys can have a chat room to chat in. But it's not live. Got it? What up, Hoovian Walker Wrestler? Hoovian. Hoovian. Welcome. Thank you for becoming a member. You joined right in the middle of my rant. Hoovian. Mm. I know you guys can't see the game yet. I'm just seeing if it, the audio, how it sounds. <laughs> What do you guys see this? <laughs> I 
<laughs> we understand. I've got it. It's live. <laughs> uh, BRE haunted houses. I mean, listen, if they were to have like um, Halloween Horror Nights like normal, which they are not, um, and it was safe and whatever else, we, we have done that, okay? The BRE have done Halloween Horror Nights. We have done it, guys. We have gone through a haunted house. We have gone through it. We've done it. We've done it. But the closest you're gonna ever get of an actual uh, ghost hunt is Phasmophobia, so I'm sorry. You're just gonna have to deal with that. I have zero desire to mess with ghosts in real life. I have experience with ghosts in real life, and I know that you don't mess with them. Otherwise, they will come and they will set up shop in your house, and you will have to deal with them because I've had it happen before. So I just don't like, I don't mess with it. Yeah, I don't need to touch the Ouija board. I don't need to look at any, I don't need, I don't need any of that. I just don't need it. I don't need to take anything home. I don't need to like, nope, I have zero desire. I can like, what does, what does being there and seeing it with my own eyes is not, I like, I already believe in ghosts. You don't need to convince me. I love that you guys can hear the giant scorpion thing. Look at this, this is what you're hearing. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. Look at that. This is where we're at, guys. So yeah, I already believe in ghosts. I don't need to go there in person to see them. Like, I'm convinced. So, and at, at that point, I need nothing else. Like, I'm good. I'm 100% good. RJ City's done Halloween Horror Nights, and apparently he had a shield of people, apparently, to protect him when he went. That's what That was his words. A shield of people. Y'all should play Manhunt in the house. We could. This house is big enough. If the volume is off when we start the game, just let me know. Intern space. Pause. Pause. Escape. <laughs> Quick save. Gonna need that. Two in the front and two in the back. Is that the name of your porno? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's too early. <laughs> um... Yes, all of this is normal. <laughs> I'm sorry. Forgive me. Mm, reload. There, there it is. I was waiting for it. I was waiting for it. <laughs> I can hear that, ooh, you're being weird. <laughs> you know it's good when I make RJ City uncomfortable. Alright, let's start a new game. You guys ready? <laughs> right? Th thank you, Type 5. Thank oh, God. Wait, what? What? Rookie, what? Wastelander. I ain't no rookie. Friendly fire off. Come on, man. Here we go. For a veteran strategy game player seeking a challenge. For the hardest of the hard, a soul killing nightmare of brutality. Not even remotely fair. That's bullshit. I am somewhat tempted to choose Ranger, but then I'm afraid it'll all just suck at it. Also, hello, Art. How 
are you? And Punisher, we are definitely planning on doing more with uh, the BRE and the party and more. We talked about we need it. We need ten on Among Us. We've done it twice now. So what you guys are watching is still the first go, right? Like that's the first time we filmed it. We just literally played for like four hours. I'm not joking. Um, it was a lot, and we all were having fun, and we were like, "Yeah, this is great." We also did it again, still again with the eight of us, and we were like, "Nah, we need more. We need ten. And there's plenty. Like we're all definitely down to do more. Um, who knows, maybe RJ City will pop up in one of those games. He does have a knack for just appearing randomly in places people don't expect him. Let's go, Ranger. Let's go, Ranger. Friendly fire on, hard combat difficulty. It's for a veteran strategy game, players seeking a challenge. Sounds like me, right? Because I don't need, see, I don't need to play I, I'm not, I don't need, see, it's called Supreme Jerk. That's funny. I'll save Supreme Jerk for another playthrough. We'll go Ranger for now. But, hard, friendly fire is on, so let's not shoot each other, please. Ranger HQ. Every monster was a man first, was it? I mean, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure there's just it's been straight a up rough few there. years for the Desert Rangers. Listen. When the world ended, they tried to bring some order to what was left of Arizona. But then the Cochise AI woke up, and they found themselves in a fight to the death with its robot army. In the end, they had to nuke their own base to kill the damn thing for good been hard going ever since. Then, the rangers heard from a fella calling himself the Patriarch. They basically summed up Wasteland 2 right there. But his kids were trying to steal it from him. And if the rangers were to come and put him in their place, he'd give Arizona all the food and supplies it needed to rebuild and survive. route across a frozen lake. Find it. I copy that. That's me, for sure. Whoa! Well, we're like the Batman. Rangers are to interfere in family squabbles. They weren't really in a position to say no. Our route's around that dam on the far shore. Scouts, check out the ice and lead us across. Yes, ma'am. So the brass and Ranger Team November across the Rockies. Because the aid he was promising the rangers wasn't just their best hope. I wouldn't trust it. It was their last. Okay, Major. All good. Come ahead. Famous last words. That's how I'd be riding on it right there, hanging on the side. I would not be inside. I'd be ready to bail out. They're gonna shoot something and blow up that lake, for sure. Oh no! Not exploding baby heads. Oh shit, watch out guys! Shit! Run this way! Get him! Get him! Hostiles! We're surrounded! Fire! Somebody rolled for initiative. God damn. But that's the thing about the Rangers. It doesn't matter how hard it gets or how many of them fall. My friend! They keep on fighting. My friend! Yeah, the Rangers are badass. The Rangers never stop fighting. Post apocalyptic world. The Rangers are. Well, <clears throat> it would be selling them short in the story short to say they were the good guys, okay? But as far as like 
groups in this post-apocalyptic world. Though, yeah, the Rangers are are some of some of the better guys. I, I'll say that. The thing I love about the Wasteland games and the Fallout games is that basically everyone's an asshole because it's post-apocalyptic and everyone's out for themselves. Now, in this game, you start off, you make a duo, okay? You make two characters, right? And you're obviously gonna get a lot more. And you can choose from these pre-made guys, these pre-made duos. We got Young Rangers, <clears throat> Yuri and Spence. Punk lovers. Thrills, kills, and spills are the life breath of these star-crossed punk rock lovers who fought their way out of the cult they were raised in. Now, if that is not precious, I don't know what is. Bronco and Kickboy. He's a mechanic. He's an enforcer. Hell yeah. Like, they're cool. I'm definitely going to create, I think, a... <clears throat> a custom pair. William and Li Tsing. Hell yeah. Sniper. See, actually, if I was going to make, when I make a custom character, it's going to be more like this. A, a melee, sneaky, although I would rather have the sniper rifle be the sneaky. <clears throat> um, but where he's got the melee, she's got the sniper rifle. Father and daughter. William has been a nearly wordless killing machine since his wife died. His daughter, Li Tsing, does all the talking and some of the killing. Okay. Mentor and student. Dusty, the survivalist. Mary, the modder. <laughs> Mercs who've served under good commanders and bad, they hope. This is the time they're fighting for folks who won't make them do terrible things. Tech heads, look at them in their cute little glasses. Science geeks who fell in love. They are socially awkward with outsiders, but chatty with each other, reveling in in, in jokes only they get. Wow. They're cool. Connoisseur. The young Rangers. So that's all the pre-made teams. They're cool. But I do think I would rather create a custom pair. Perhaps. Just, so I know in the end too, they, everything I've read about this game is like, don't get caught up on the characters that you create in the beginning. And they're like, it is fun. And they do recommend that you create custom, like most things did because they were like, they're great and they're fine, but like you, you there's any nut. They don't definitely don't cover everything, um, so they recommended making your own. But they are cool, and it kind of gives me an idea. I do really like these guys, Bronco and Kickboy. Bronco and Kickboy is just fun. Star-crossed punk lovers. So cute. So cute. I don't know the Yuri joke. I only know Yuri from Phasmophobia. They are aggressive. Create custom. I don't know. The neat the, the geek nerds are pretty funny too. They revel in their in jokes. I'm like, okay, that's pretty funny. Wait, can we hit back? Uh, no. Wait, yes. No. Coyote. Hmm. We can handle this, right? Why does she have that voice? Spotted. Let's look at their background. in Arizona, raised among scientists. You know how to do research. It's not hard. The desert cat. Perception plus one. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to... We're in it now! Make 
Like a male and a female. The, 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 the female is gonna be my sniper. Hawk's not a bad name for a sniper as well. We'll leave it for now. Here they come. I like this. Now, let's find her a good sniper background. Desert cat's okay. Disciple of the metal. How much you want to bet Shayna chose this one? You're in the Rangers because you love bombs. Yeah, they want to blow shit up. Oh, wait. Disciple of metal is fire damage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fire, explosive, what? Goat killer. Nobody believes you, but you saw what you saw. A giant red goat standing over your mother's body. Freaky golden eyes glittering in the night. Goats aren't normal, just listen to them. You're gonna kill every goat you can and draw out that, draw out that monster goat and this time you'll be ready. Bleep bleep, motherfucker. This game is amazing already because I read that word for word and that is exactly what it said. I'm um, crit chance 5%. Guys, for crit, that is insane. What? At the gate? Honest. I, I'm obsessed with this. She's the goat killer. My sniper woman is insane. And she's going to kill the goat. This is, this is amazing. Um... What's up, first person Shane? I love that Shana and I got Drew First Blood. I love that the very first game we played was me and Shana as, as partners. It was amazing. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking, Queens. Like, look at this mullet. Look at this mullet. Oh. What? That is... What? I'm in love with this woman right now. No, no. Lady Samurai, which is pretty cool. Oh, we're going mullet. We're going mullet sniper. It should be queen mullet right there. You tell her the goat killer does, tie five. And tell her I was just reading, I was just reading the dialogue. I didn't say that, I was just reading the dialogue. I wanted it to be accurate, you know? if I was gonna have to change that. Yeah, I usually have been putting it in the in the bottom corner too. Well, 
like this. Yeah, you guys couldn't see anything. Yeah, her mullet head is amazing. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, you know what's gonna also be annoying, though? Um, that. <clears throat> the face, from what I've heard, is the only thing you can't really change. Your, your character's sex and their face. Uh, oh. Oh, yes. Okay. Alright. Scars. Nice. Green. Oh my god, she can be the Hulk. Yeah, yep. Yeah, we <laughs> she starts really pale and then she ends up green. The the normal spectrum. I don't know. I'm kind of digging the the she Hulk. Just me? Anybody? Anybody else? Anybody? Just me? Ooh! What? Yo, she looks wicked. That looks insane. I like that one. Just a big old scar. This is from the goat attack. I kind of like the blonde. <laughs> Oh, the white? There it is. That's even better. That's what I was actually looking for. I was like, I wanted it to be as light as it could be, but I think that's perfect. Where's, is there all black? Is that black? Nah, the white is better. Oh yeah, here we go. What do we got? I need something to show off that mullet, though, okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. right there like one of these maybe even this one I just like being able to see that she's got green skin and a mullet fashion fashion is my favorite part of any game first person Shane we we, we know this 
Damn, she looks cool. can't see my pants, but trust me. The tactical pants are pretty good. colors right now. I like this how it is. It's fun. Physique! <laughs> Gigantic! Punky. Puny. Clearly, she needs to be gigantic. A solid eight foot four, <clears throat> at least. Slender, what? Jacked, stocky. Comp Whoa! Wait. What? Amazing. I didn't, you can make them a tiny. But we just want jacked. This is clearly, this is Shirk right here. This is Shirk. Where's she at? Nobody's got green skin though. Nobody's gonna. So this is basically your character portrait, which I think I might choose this one with the hood so that it, it's, it's the most, you can't really tell. It looks the most like her without, like obviously they're not gonna have a character portrait that has green skin and you know, whatever. Look at her. We'll probably have to change her name. To, well not probably. We absolutely have to change her name to Shirk. That's like my go-to, this character is, her name is Shirk. Don't ask me why, it just is. All right, now starting with Quippin. Let's look at this guy real quick. We're in it now. We got this. Spotted. Spotted. Are you crazy? Oh, are we going? Okay. Okay. Okay, we... 
Um, let's see. Now, I want this guy to be melee, so I want to find me a good melee... Ooh, melee damage bonus right here. You're a good time to be out of control, cop. Lethal weapon. You've been taken to the fight to slave to combat someone back up. Da, da, da. Someone called you a loose cannon, so I don't know. This one's pretty good. Kick ass. Kiss ass. You're a kiss ass plus one. Damn. Yeah, if you grew up in LA, you would get kiss ass plus one. That's for sure. You're goddamn right she can pretend to be a tree. I can make him look like RJ City. I can make him look like RJ. I definitely saw his haircut. But he's gonna have to be a melee character, I think. Hard ass penetration. Melee damage bonus. I'll just take the melee damage bonus. Oh, are we going? Okay. Oh, are Get we... ready. Here they come. We're in it now. Let's epic finish. Epic. Don't let me die. Sex machine. Combat speed. That's pretty good. Two. People hoard money, power. They kill each other still all for one thing. Getting laid. It's biology. It's the reason we do everything. You know it. You don't hide it. And you do it better than anyone. We're animals. And if we're going to be honest, it feels good to be an animal. That's actually maybe even better than straight damage. If I'm a... Mm, I think I might go sex machine. I'm not even joking. Let's mess with his appearance first. Let's find this RJ City hair first. I don't know about that. He also doesn't need a beard. Oh, we gotta change that face. <laughs> He's 87 years old. That's RJ City for sure. choices are actually not nearly as good as the female choices. Am I right? Actually, I'm gonna go with the old man, I think. I feel like for an RJ City character, that is, that is, uh, that is the most appropriate. 
the, the war paint sucks for the guys. And I'm telling you, I know this. This is one of the things I know. They were like, basically, during character creation, they were like, anything can be changed or reset once you unlock the Ranger HQ. So it's not really an issue. The only thing you cannot change is your character's sex and their face, their actual face. That's, th that's it. Hair, beard, helmet, clothes, physique, all this other stuff can change. Their face and their sex cannot change. So I, I just, I like this guy being old. I just want him to be old. Um, <clears throat> the hair is appropriate. We got, we need no beard. Now let's put a nice hat. Nice helmet. That's nice right there. I like that one. What about that one? He'd get too hot in that, I feel like, wouldn't you? Whoa. Whoa, where'd these come from? That's why I'm kind of thinking I feel the same way. I kind of like this one because he can show off his hair. I don't like his face being like obviously fully covered. Um, I want that hair showing. <laughs> that one's kind of cool too. I like it as just like a small, partially covering one. This one also just straight up looks like a gimp mask. Actually, maybe that's what I'll do. Let's leave this one. Actually, I like that. Straight up. What? Winter parka. Tundra jacket. Infantry jacket. A veteran's jacket, huh? Just a gunslinger vest, look at that, little... Heavy. There we go. Where's the heavy? Don't worry, we're gonna work on this, guys. I got an idea. Old man, old man RJ and She Hulk. Yeah. She's the sniper, you'd never guess it, guess it, and he's the sex machine, you'd never guess it. I'll leave the color what it is for now. Alright. You know, he's taller than you think. Me 
medium. Medium. like this. Maybe my favorite so far. Yeah. Is there an old man that doesn't have a beard? Straight up, just make a clown. Hmm. None of these really look like what I'm going for. So let's choose one of these without a face. Yeah, they, they kind of sucks actually. There's not much to choose from character portrait wise. There we go. That's better. It's not quite him, but. This one was the one I was looking at. That one's pretty cool too. His one good eye. That's the one he winks at you with. The Eyclops. Yeah. I'm sorry. It has the name Eyclops. Yeah, I don't, I'm, we're using that. We can handle this, right? Shoot. Choo choo. Here comes the pain train. <laughs> choo choo. Come and get me. This is not the best way to begin an engagement. Is this not educated masculine? Striking masculine. first gives a strong tactical advantage. The outcome was never in doubt. I need medical attention. This is perfect. Tell me. Tell me. Cooperation is key to victory. Uh -oh. this is they have us at a disadvantage. I need RJ City to name to name this character. There. 
And there he is! RJ City, please help me name this character that I've made after you. First of all, let me explain. Let me explain. Okay? That's not his name. That's the default name. This is me. Her name is Shirk. She's gigantic and a sniper. She's also the goat killer. Um, I would like to read you this background, please. This is for my character, just so you understand. It says, nobody believes in you, but you know what you saw. A giant red goat standing over your mother's body. Freaky golden eyes glittering in the night. Goats just aren't normal. Just listen to them. You're going to kill every goat you can and draw out that monster goat. And this time, you'll be ready. Bleat, bleat, motherfucker. I said it quieter that time so Ty Five's family doesn't get angry. That's my character. She's pretty much done. Her, her name is Shirk. Okay, it's just what it is because she's green and she has a mullet. All right? This guy is very old. He's the oldest that you could be. Um, look. That's... I gave him your hair. He's very old. He has no beard. Now, his background... Also this. They've spotted us! The educated masculine voice is perfect. Let's put the odds in our favor. <laughs> but his background is sex machine! People hoard money, power, they kill each other, steal, all for one thing. Getting laid. It's biology. It's the reason we do everything. Oh, oh. You know it, and you don't hide it. And you do it better than anyone. We're animals! And if we're being honest, it feels good to be an animal. And it makes your combat speed up. So you're gonna be good in melee, which is gonna be fun. Um, so this guy, who... Sounds kind of nerdy. This is not the best way to begin an engagement. This is not the best way to begin an, an engagement, guys. Is you. Billy Baru. Billy Baru? Who's been... <laughs> I don't know. Okay. There he is. But now I'm going to put this uh, mask back on him because I like... Um... Where was it at? This... I like this one, this Eyclops one. No, you just, I want him to have something on his head to help. Listen, the wasteland is rough, okay? You're gonna want a little something. That's why I like the eye clops, though, so you can still wink with that one good eye right there, see? And unfortunately, I feel like there's not a good portrait to fit. That's about as close as I can find. That like literally, there's just not much. That looks like. Glasses with no frames, even better. Exactly, Art. The sex machine has to be good at close quarters, right? See, if this one didn't have a, it didn't have this little beard, I would pick him. But even this guy's got this little goatee. This is about the only guy that doesn't. I feel like maybe this is him in his younger days. Let's go with that. This is his younger portrait. We'll go with that. Billy Baru, the sex machine, and Shirk. Okay, sh starting weapon. Bladed, blunt, brawling, heavy. No, heavy weapon. Uh, a blade, blade or blunt. RJ City, what do you think? Yeah, I really only want bladed or 
blunt with him. That's nice, a big old wrench of some sort, or just a knife. I don't know, that looks pretty, pretty, um. Pretty badass right there, old Billy Baru. He left already, he showed up and he left already. I should have a high charisma. Two in strength. some damage. He's quite, he's quite fast, this guy. Strength abilities. And be an effective leader, isn't that, isn't that something? Wait, go back. Definitely do need uh, some of the coordination. And health, you have to take care of your body. Yeah, he should. There, I think that, those three. Coordination, speed, and strength. Jeez, okay. Here we go. Melee. Melee and... Sneaky. Coaster repair. Hmm. Fascinating. And then we'll give him one and something else. Maybe we give him Animal Whisperer! Explosives, defuse bombs, and avoid losing your digits when they go off. Hmm. 
Jesus, one point in barter allows you to get so much better, so I need to eventually get that. But for this guy, I think... go lock picking for now. So some people were saying they don't like quirks, but but I want them cuz they have like advantages and disadvantages. And I just like giving them something, you know. Um some rangers are quirkier than others. Quirks are completely optional, so a quirk gives your ranger a powerful bonus and penalty, changing their playstyle dramatically. Character creation is the only change you'll have to assign a quirk, and once you do, you're stuck with it. Choose wisely. So there's like, see, that's not worth it. Blunderer, insane. It drops your crit chance. Like, nope. No, I don't want to do anything that drops my combat speed. I'm gonna say, no, maybe not evasion. Cannot wear armor of any kind. What? What's that, what's it do though? Okay. Action points, oh Jesus. Doomsday Prepper. That's me. <laughs> um, when you are on your own, leadership has no benefits on you. Initiative plus 20, though. That's great. Lone Wolf. Poindexter. Hmm. Prospector. Quick slots minus one, but you occasionally discover valuable gold nuggets while digging. What? Pyro. Oh, we know from RimWorld they're bad. But you get a 15% chance to catch on fire when using explosives, but you get all this shit. <laughs> Sadomasochist. Ooh, here we go. Receives 33% 30 more damage, but you also do far more damage. So... Maybe Mr. Sex Machine needs to be a sadomasochist. I kind of like that. Serial killer? Gain three AP for each kill in combat once per turn. Hmm. So far, the sadomasochist is my favorite. He takes more damage, but he does more damage. Two pump chump, excuse me? Nah. The fury of ancient warriors flows through you. You've walked, so you have all these resistances, but then your experience bonus is lower. Huh. That might not be a bad idea as well. 50% damage while drunk. No, no, we can't have that in that. So this basically gives him all these resistances, bleeding, poison, shock, burning, frozen, which would be great for my dude that's gonna be right in the middle of all the stuff. But his experience bonus is in minus 15. He's old. He's already seen the world. This is actually a perfect quirk for him. He's got all these resi- He's old! You see? Old Billy Baru. This is perfect. He's done. He is done. Let's- Do we- Can I give him white hair also? Yeah, that's way better. Way, way better. Sandstorm. Here we go. That's not bad. There we go. Alright, Shirk, the goat killer. She's just weird. You know what she is? For those of you that know Baldur's Gate history, she's Minsk. She's Minsk. That's that's me. I can't wait. Alright, alright, alright. Let's see. Yeah. Man. 
let's do some of these. Speed evasion. Awareness. Range damage bonus. Oh yeah. Awareness. And then luck. There's a bunch of crap. So we'll say I'm just a little bit lucky. Awareness and intelligence. That is so me. With a little bit of luck. Perfect. Skills. Let's see. Sniper rifles. Okay, it goes to five. Let's go to three. And then see what else we got. If I can drop, like, maybe one in... Toaster repair. I'm a hard ass. Nice. She needs hard ass. I need, I, I need, yeah. Yeah, she should be a hard ass. For sure. Um... And an animal whisperer. Yep. Hard ass, animal whisperer, and sniper rifles. Wait, sneaky shit. Maybe I need that. Damn. Okay, we can hold off on hard ass. And let's do sneaky shit. There we go. Initiative, perception, sneak attack damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All this is good. Okay, we go back. And then let's look at her quirk. Um, so we pretty much looked at all of them. Leadership has no benefits on you. Lone wolf. Look at Shirk. Tell me she's not a lone wolf. That's right. Initiative plus 20%, but leadership has no benefits on me. Guys. I want to look at hair options one more time, just to make sure, but... I think that's probably the best one. <laughs> Lady Samurai, very appropriate. Actually, I might leave it like that. I'm not even joking. Huh? Huh? Yeah? Look at this. All right, let's confirm and get started because I need to um, refill my coffee cup. Let's wrap it up. Also, if it's too hard and I can't beat it, I'll just I'll drop the difficulty down. But I think I should be able to handle it. What? Sure. Wait, that's me. They got initiative on us. Look at, look at old Billy, look at him right there. Just crouch. Sutures. I can't help you, friend. Billy Baru, your turn. All right, what you got here? 95, 95. 8, where's my, yeah. Okay. Oh, 
combat movement. Da, da, da. Blue spaces are areas where you can move. Areas within red shows where they can't. A low goes right. We should all have a nice stretch after that. Thank you, Loco. Indeed. Everyone, please take a moment. Praise the sun. Let me get through this. Let me get through this initial tutorial. It's like, here's combat. Got it. Got it. Blue is where I can go. Orange is... Wait. And then hit. again. Not enough AP. Spending leftover AP once you finished. Blah, blah, blah. That's okay. Use... Open up your quick bar. Select your final a action. Ambush, defend, or prepare. Okay, where... Uh, defend. Prepare. Hmm. Should have moved right there. Oh, no! not want you to do that. You, you, you. Can I hit you? Sure. A miss! This is bullshit. Can you prepare? Bullshit. I get the worst. Oh my god! Where did you come from? Oh god, Billy, watch out! Oh wait, is that ours? Is he helping us? No one shoot Billy. Everyone leave him alone. I swear to God, if you mess with Billy, I'm gonna be so mad. Hey, that's all. Huh? Come on, you piece of. There's the problem. What's the Hang problem? Hang in there, November. Almost got it. Excuse me. All right, Billy. I'm gonna need you to kill this guy. Quack. How'd you miss, Billy? Help me, that'd be great. Oh boy. Oh boy, they moving in on me. Oh shit. Haha, uh -huh, you can't haha. Uh -huh, you missed Billy. Haha, uh -huh, look at that. Oh Jesus. November, you have targeting control. Huh? Oh my god, finally. Time to even the odds. Okay. Okay, Billy, first of all, you killed this guy. Whack. There it is. And then I want you to go back to hiding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good. Out of range. Out of range. Out of range. Let's go here. Good. Shirk's gonna take further shots, I'm realizing. Um, 3 AP. Hide. Yeah, go, go hide over here. There you go. Much better. Now. That's right. Oh, you about to die! Oh, we can't hit. That'll hit, that'll hit Billy. We don't want to hit Billy. We don't want to hit Billy. Let's do this right here. Boom. Get him, Billy! Whack! Wow, that still wasn't enough. Okay, hide. And then 
Shirk. Murder. What? Thank you, everyone. Thank you. you. Well done. Well done. I am on hard, by the way. Listen. If you want to live through this, okay. you've got to take out the bastards with the rocket launcher up on the dam. Okay. Whoa, that is chunky. That is, that is, I need it. I need fresh coffee. Chunky is and it's bulletproof, okay? Don't be too grossed out. We'll each find our own way up there and okay. catch them front and back. Find a way to the got top it. of the dam. Got it? Got it. Me and Billy got it. Yeah, yeah, we got it. Now's not the time for attitude, Rangers. Remember, Arizona's depending on us. There's no quitting here. There's no going back. That's right. What up, Vinny? Good morn. All right. All, All right. right. Goodbye. All right, I feel like I got a pretty good handle on that. Not, not a bad first uh, encounter. Spent big lighter. Oh. Spikes. Can controlling a single character. This is useful when setting up for a fight, navigating past landmines, but the bugs, supporting the roads, to integrate a squad together, pressing space, or by left clicking drag. Here's it. Okay, cool. I like the tutorials. I want them to continue helping me. Pause real quick. I am gonna move this up a hair. I feel like it needs to go up just a hair. Like this. Yeah, something like this. Yeah, that's like slightly above where I was at. That's better. I like that better now. I like these better. Um, select everyone together. Control, shoot, yeah. Shift for that. Okay. Let me refill my coffee cup, y'all. I'll be right back. This was a great way. We got started. We got Shirk. We got Billy Baru. I'm excited. Um, I'll be back in just a few minutes. Don't go anywhere. Thank you to everybody watching. Hello, new subs. Hello, new members. Happy to see you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, I'm not done. So just give me a few minutes and I'll be right back. Uh, remember, pay the tax. That's right. Just click the like. That's all you gotta do. And then I don't care. You can do whatever you want after that. Okay, bye. I mean, not bye. Just bye. Be back in a minute.
Got this sweet ass hoodie. Yeah, that's right. Um, I ordered it off the internet. I just saw it and hit buy. Okay, I fell prey to one of those. We've all done it. And if you haven't, you need to ask yourself, have you really truly lived yet? All right, I'm back, guys. Thank you all for waiting. I appreciate it. It's important, all right? When you stream for like five hours at a time, <laughs> at least for me. All right, we got, this is my favorite cup of coffee right here. I just want everyone to know this. This is why I feel like I need to say it every time. Just plain good black coffee is my favorite. It's really like the most enjoyable thing and like such a comfort thing. And you can get caffeine, like as long as I get caffeine some way, I'm good, okay? But that right there is my preferred white. What up, Major FOMO? All right, let's return to the game. Shirk, you need some help. Billy Baru. Hold on, I need help to do one thing. something real quick everyone there we go okay and be back Close. more awake to enjoy it yes and I do know I understand the importance of like getting like the right things happening in your digestive system first thing in the morning as far as hydrating and whatever for me I know it works and it's why I really do like the bulletproof because it gets all that good stuff in there it gets something like in my stomach right away that doesn't upset it that also doubles as coffee and what you know it, it's also enjoyable but it's not like preferred oh wait select all <clears throat> and then shift highlights things Ooh, tire tracks. this is literally the first time i've been play i've played this game everyone i played wasteland 2 like five years ago i think And I know about Wasteland 1, but I never played it. Tread marks lead away from the ambush. If a ranger vehicle escaped, the broken ice has hidden their trail. All right. Well, good. That means maybe some other rangers made it out, you know? Oh, there it is. Oh, that does work out. Okay. Eh? Corpse. There are powder burdens on this ranger's jacket. Oh boy, oh boy. What's happening? Shoot him. Not even gonna risk it. Not even gonna risk it. Way to go, way to go, shirt. Colorado dollars. How about that? Ooh. What a badass. Billy Baru. Look at that hair. It's the Lady Samurai. Healing after combat. Ah, oh, yes. Your rangers are injured. Fortunately, they are also equipped with med hypos they can use to heal themselves. To use one, left click your items button in the quick bar, then left click on the med hypo. Okay. But I don't necessarily just want to do that all willy nilly. How many of those do I have? Cool. Oh, 
Find a way to the top of the dam. Man, it really starts you right in the middle of this. It's cool. I don't think that's weird, who me? I went through a phase where all I drank was tea. It just, I was just missing, I was missing the comfort uh, part of, of the coffee. Like, I could drink it, it worked, it was fine, but it just made me like, I just still missed. I think it's cause it, I don't know, it's like a thing I, I started doing like, I don't know, my parents did it. And so I, dr I started drinking coffee pretty young. Not like, not like, a little kid, but definitely when I was a teenager, I tried it and liked it. I was definitely drinking coffee before most of my friends were, and I liked it. A reputation? Ooh. Fame. I'm gonna live forever. Uh, the more you impact the lives of the people of Colorado, the more locals will recognize you as your fame grows, more folks will sign up to become rangers. Filling out the ranks of guards and staffers at Ranger HQ. All right. We've got a lot of work to do, rangers. Let's go. I know. Lots of people watching today. New game hype. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, you're dead. You... Uh... He's just little chunks now. It's... Maybe we don't go over there. How do I sneak? It's not told me yet, so I'm assuming maybe I just don't need to know, okay? His eyes are wide open. They reflect the fire of burning trucks. Well, that's dark. I don't trust this ice one bit. This ranger was beaten to death. Jesus. Um, let's go. This truck is empty. Looks like the occupants managed to escape. But you can't tell where they went. Oh, okay. Someone sliced open this ranger's abdomen and removed his intestines. He was alive when it happened. Uh, awesome. Not, not awesome. Let me see. Okay, there's a question mark up here. Reservoir and trail. God. God, I'm so scared. Why is there a question mark on the map? Oh, it's just telling me we're on the trail now. Where's your CO? How should Where's I know? Your CO? It, maybe you blew her up already. Liar! I want her head. It's gonna be me who bring it to Jarrett. Where is she? Why? Oh, no. Why? Oh, no. Why do the bad guys have to be hillbilly Hiding sounded? Me. Why? You're denying me my glory. Get that fucking gun off of me! I don't know. <sighs> Stupid cow! You're wasting my time. Don't do it. I'm coming! Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Um, wait. Can you sneak? What is sneak? Sneak. Shit, space, escape. Load C is attributes, attributes, <laughs> attributes, attributes, inventory, Jer oh yeah, okay, um, all that stuff, right, next character, previous character, tag, parry, skills, okay, crouch down,
But it says if they move. Oops. See if I can hit her. Can I... can I hit her? Target blocked. Okay, hold on. Target blocked. How do I sneak? Fuck! Your friends are here! Look at Shirk. Don't mess with her. Okay, Hotlanders. Drop your guns and she doesn't die. Got it? It didn't want me to be able to do that. It's showing me different things right now. This is basically the, tutor the tutorial. Nah, it's more of what someone thinks a, a, a redneck. See, there is a difference, first of all, between redneck and hillbilly. And I would say that's more redneck, if I'm being honest. All right, requirement not met, requirement not met. Look at this, damn, if I chose hard ass, we might have had a, another option, but we don't, so we're just gonna attack. Bastards, I told you I'd kill her. Okay, oh, sorry. We weren't equipped, you know? Ammo box, oh thank God. Death Knight, how are you, man? Proud we are of you, and that we will be praying hard for your safe return. And don't you worry about us, none. We'll get by. We always do. Remember not to sass the officers, and don't drive so fast. You ain't racing to Colorado and back. Just, uh, just keep your head down and your eyes open. I see. I mean, anybody. I see, I see, I see. I was sorry. I was looking at the weapons down here. What was going on? See, that cranberry orange herbal tea does sound good. Herbal? 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 What is it? Do we know? See, nobody sounds like that. Joy! No! But but that's how people talk when they they think Don't they're doing worry, the impression. You won't be grieving long. Murder. Especially that. That sounds Sad like fucks. real southern, a different kind of southern. All right, game saved. It says okay. I need to know how to sneak. Billy, 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 get your ass up here, Billy. There you go. Now you're in a good spot. 
Then we go back to Shirk, and then she's gonna shoot this bear. Oh wait, that's an oil tank. Sorry, Jeremy. We never should have signed up for this. All right, let's take out the important guys first. Twenty-two hunter. This one, she's tough. All right. Can you crouch? Boom! Oh shit, that was it. My turn! Got it. Billy, go kill. Ah, smack. There it is. Oh shit, that wasn't enough. What? That's right, shoot the barrel, I dare you. Alright, you. Trying to oh wait, you can't why can't I? Not enough AP. Oh wait, move right there. Oh shit! God! Okay, okay! I forgot oh shit! They get turns too. Fine. Oh Jesus. Here you go. Use the med hypo. Good Nice. Now can you still hit him? and take this guy out. Did it. It was risky. It wasn't my best shot. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. I think it... Well, I don't think it did. It, my internet tanked completely... And I was getting nothing. And so I had to restart my stuff, but I think it says that we're in the green now, so. Let me know if I'm back. Sorry about that. Appreciate you guys sticking through it. My internet, I have Spectrum, and it's just, it's trash. I don't even care to bury them live. Like, it's trash. We got it because it was the only option for high speed internet, and, and it's like, it just goes out randomly and stops working and they're just like, there's an outage and that's it. And I'm like, like we pay way too much for internet for it to just not work most of the time. Most of the time. It's, it's just ridiculous. So I apologize. Hopefully it's working. Now let's pray. <laughs> Please and praise the sun. Please. Internet. I know I just said your shit, but but could you please, just for once, for once. Oh wow, Loco, thanks for sounding so optimistic. All right, out of range, out of range, out of range. Billy! Get him. I said try the strike, but I, I just wanna kill this guy real quick. Kill him. Mm, you're lucky you're in cover. Free oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Get him, Billy. Okay. Precision strike. Let's try it. Ooh! Headshot. Damn. This is Major Prasad. I took an outflow pipe through to the far side of the dam. Now it looks like I can get up behind those yahoos on the top and take them unawares. Let me know when you're in position and we'll... <gasps> Shit! Incoming fire! Taking cover! What up, Stacy Lynn? Alright. Everyone? Ew. 
Ew, there's something living in there and it ain't your foot. The moldy sock? Gross. We got a medic pack. We got this. Energy cells. Okay. We did not have to explode the barrel. This ranger was dragged out of a vehicle, disemboweled, and left to die of blood loss and cold. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Talk to this guy. Why didn't you get here sooner? Really? Look what they did to Joey. He, he's dead. Yeah, well, you could be too. You're welcome. Sorry about your friend, but now we have to save ourselves. Come on, we have to keep moving. Damn right. Gotta get poor Joey back to AC. Our orders are to take the dam. I don't care. I'm finding a way back. Traitor! I can't let Joey be buried here. The ground nah, bitch. is too cold. Nah, bitch. Not gonna happen. We need you. Get moving or I'll kill you myself. Um. You can still fight. I'm gonna try to be nice first. We need you. Do you not freaking understand? Like, I get it, but like... Why are you kidding yourselves? We are done. Just let me go. Get moving, or I'm gonna kill you myself. So, you're gonna help these savages finish this off? No, you're trying to... Thank you. This is... You can't just, in the middle of the battle, just be like, I'm gonna go home now. That's not how this works. Deserters get executed. Don't. Yeah, we'll take your bullets then. I'm not gonna let you, like, uh, desert us. Like, no, fuck you. I'm right! Alright, let's see. <laughs> oh, there we go. That's what I needed. I was trying to just click and do it. This is, listen, uh, about that though, FOMO, this is like way after the end of the world. This is after the end of the world happened and then every, like, and then like society rebuilt in a different way. Like many, 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 many years have passed. So who knows who's moved where and, and who's settled in where. And also I will say though, there are rednecks everywhere. Anywhere I've ever traveled in, in this world. And I've not gone everywhere. But I've gone a few places. Everywhere I go, there's rednecks. They found their way into, in, into most places. And for the record, I do not consider myself a redneck. Alright, let's not get it twisted. Alright, I am a hillbilly and that's why I get real insulted when people use them interchangeably. Because they're not. Let's check out this item upgrade. Billy! Let's equip your new gear. Okay. What is the new gear? Wait. Yellow snowball. Gross! Huh? Now 
what? Let's see. Billy. Your decisions matter. So, we'll see. Jesus! Oh, another gut puppet to my name. You hearing this, Erastus? Uh -huh, you ought to be here. The deluge of blood has begun, and I'm with The deluge. Oh, what's that? excuse me, but who's this? Enemy detection. Look out! There's a big ass robot ahead. Luckily, it doesn't see you yet. Stay out of its detection range. Just go unnoticed. You can get the first turn in combat by attacking an enemy. Why am I struggling with that word today? Before it's spotted you. However, we cannot stress enough how badly that robot will fuck you up right now. Okay. So yeah, like don't, don't do it. Basically, it's not that difficult. Hello? Broken bell? Or... Wow. Repair? Nobody can do this. No. Computer? Anyone? Status ready. Enter command. Um, nerd stuff. The, the display reads blah blah blah. D disabled. Okay. Authorization. Ah. Did I do something? Did I, did I disable that one? An entire team of rangers were turned into Swiss cheese, probably by those gun toting mechanical death machines. Great. I think I. Wow. What did I just do? All right, let's go. All right. Ooh, I can do this one. Oh boy. Yeah. Billy Baru can pick locks, y'all. Scout armor. Amazing. <gasps> Whoops. I gotta be more careful. But, because he's got all those resistances to like being burnt and stuff, it didn't actually hurt him that bad. Amazing. This game is great. Deluge blood. What up, Frank? How are you, man? Rangers, Crusade here. Took care of the hostiles who jumped me, but, but those bastards are still up there on the dam. I found a spot to hunker down and give you some cover when you get there. But I'm afraid this, this will be mostly on you. Good luck and hurry. Rabbit's paw. Oh yeah, here we go. Shirk, you need the rabbit's paw right now. Because it increases your crit chance. Look at that. Crit chance pl plus three. Again, so good. So, so good. Smoke grenade. I 
don't like when it's the game saves itself for me. I just get real nervous. Medical crate, ammo box. It's never a good sign when it starts handing you all this shit. Never a good sign. Nope. Yeah, that, the only thing, no, yeah, mine's good. It's good on my end, Frank. Sometimes, for whatever reason, like, YouTube auto changes the resolution to, like, it's like 240, and I'm like, great. <laughs> All right, on the other side of the door, you can hear rough voices and laughter and rocket fire. Fun. Open the door. What else are we doing here? Looks like we killed them all. Guess the fun's over. Oh, shut up. You about to get sniped, fool. Wait a minute. Maybe not. Look at this Hi, asshole. Hotlander. <laughs> oh, as much fun as it is killing folk long distance. I like it best when the deluge of blood happens up close and deluge. personal. You know what I mean? <laughs> The rest is gonna be sorry he stayed home. He loves him some entrails. <laughs> Melee combat two. The state of your knife is a disgrace. When was the last time you cleaned and sharpened it? RJ City would say something like that. Now, granted, this guy is, you know, is, is Billy, but I'm just saying, that's 100% a thing he would say. Sharpened my... Ooh, I'll sharpen my knife on your bones and I'll wash it clean in your blood for the deluge is coming, you heathen, and I'm its harbinger. Harbinger. And it all begins here, you little prayer dog. What I do to you, the Dorsey's gonna do to all of Colorado. So squeal all Jesus. you want. No one's coming to save you. Oh, snap. Holy shit. They done killed Jared. Holy shit. Doggy. <sighs> Never shut up. Heads up, Rangers. Hell yeah. More incoming. Woo! Let's go, Rangers. All right, Billy. Let's get in there. It's what you live for, man. I feel like, though, this will explode and just murderize this guy. I really want to succeed in that. How good is this music? Where is Shirk at right now, is what I want to know. She's right there. Okay, so let's take... I think this guy I have the best chance of killing because he's got that also that explosive barrel right there. Goodbye. Damn, I still almost got him too. Now I cannot. Now will that burn me there or no? That's an oil tank. That's probably not a good idea to get near. Actually, real hidden right here. Fifty-eight. Fifty-eight. 
Let's chuck her grenade as well. chance to hit this shot but even if we don't not a big deal there we go we still got it now can I hide or is there anywhere I can go not enough not enough not, literally not enough to go anywhere I'm just a sitting duck but I'm gonna get a little bit further away from that what happened oh shit we got more coming that's okay shit Get him! Billy! That's right, Billy. Get up here. I'll go punch this guy right in the face. What other items do we have that we can use? Three? Stink. What's the stink? Mountain oyster? What? Nitro spike? Revive all incapacitated, drink to gain. So he drinks this wine, gains 25% melee damage, but suffer two AP for 60 turns afterwards. On success, success applies rowdy. Tastes as good as it smells. 36 turns, but then minus two for 60 turns. That's a lot. It's a hangover, I guess. Let's hope my video doesn't get copy strike because of the music, though. That's always a concern. Yeah, I don't know if it's if it warrants that just yet. Okay, we got a yellow snowball. We can't use it yet. Forty-eight percent. 88%. Ooh, I might can drop this guy. Woo! Did it! Can I hit him? Hit him! Throw the snowball! I'm looking at my percentages here, man, to see what works. Oh my god, I got a precision strike. Let's do it. Ooh, headshot! Let's do it! Please don't miss. Don't you miss. Damn! Epic. You are alright, Billy. Billy! Get the final blow! What? There it is. Nice. Yeah, Saint it coming. Mission updated. Leveling up. Huzzah! 
Okay. everything hell yeah that was awesome we did it huzzah her breath steams from her clenched teeth her guts are spilling through her bloody fingers. Nice work finishing off that jerk's crew. Did you find any other survivors? Yeah, that one I had to shoot back there. Um. Nope. Just us. Damn it. <coughs> Damn. Just us. <coughs> oh, Jesus. She fumbles in her knapsack. Yes. I'm bleeding. Okay. All over the paperwork. Okay. We need to, to head for Colorado Springs. Establish a headquarters at Peterson Air Force Base. Okay. Support the Patriarch, no matter what. What? We do that, and the Patriarch sends aid to the Arizona Rangers. We don't, and the Rangers are fucked. And that brings me to the secret orders. What's happening? How secret? Who else knows about them? Uh, only me. Uh, got them from got them from General Woodson. Well, so you and General Woodson? When we first heard from the Patriarch, General Woodson sent an sent an advance team to Colorado, led by Angela Death. But what? they went dark. We have to find them. I'm going to move my script my camera up a little bit to to avoid um covering the subtitles as well after this cutscene wait can i do it in the cutscene oh uh, yes perfect there there we go boom all right what do you know about this patriarch? Who is Angela Death? We thought Angela Death was killed in a mission to California. Understood, we'll get it done. Um, who is she? Part of the Ranger squad that took down base Cochise 20 years ago. Only one who's, who's still alive. Almost died on a mission in California, but, but she found her way home. I can't, can't believe they didn't tell you about her in training. What? Give me a second. Catch my breath, and we can go. Bitch, I don't think you're going anywhere. Um, put her out of her misery. How bad do you think your wounds are there, Major? It doesn't matter how bad my wounds are. We can't stay here. No, you're right. Let's get up, then. Ah, oh, her intestines have slumped out of her tumbling to the snow. <gasps> We tried. Give me your stuff. New mission. Yeah. Acquiring skill points. Yeah. Let's do sneaky shit because I need I need the perception to find like traps and stuff. That's gonna be pretty important. 
And then Billy. Wait. Yes. Billy. How much is that? Upgrade to two. Okay. And then... But see, it's also, like, it's also very... Yeah, I'm gonna keep stick them on their uh, keep them on their focus of their main skills right now until I just really feel like I need something else. Yes, confirm. Confirm. Nice. little improvement. Wait, what? Yeah. Left shift. Less ammo capacity, but hits harder and better penetration. What do you want from me, you know? Orders. Green. From Major Vera Prasad. Take command of a convoy designated Team November uh, across Rocky Mountains to the city of Colorado Springs. Make contact with Saul Buchanan, a.k.a. The Patriarch. Establish a base of operations in Colorado Springs. Recruit and train additional personnel as needed. Preserve the life and position of the Patriarch at all costs. Do whatever is necessary to secure the aid. Promise to the Desert Rangers. Locate Colonel Angela Death and her advanced team. If advanced team is deceased, collect bodies for burial. If alive, ascertain reasons of loss of communication. Disciplinary action is authorized at your discretion. See? I know the rangers work. In the event of your death or incapacitation, these orders shall apply to the senior surviving member of the expedition. That's why we got him. And then this guy, Wade Woodson. Got it. Or what? She, just the secret orders. This is all just shit to sell. Okay. Hell yeah. Weapons crate. Let's go see what's in it. Rocket. Rocket. Hey, what's that? Major Tomcat. Hello, Mr. Tomcat. Can I tame you? As you get close, you see the cat has a dog tag rather than a collar, which is embossed with the name Tom. Come on, cat. Animal whisperer. Ground control to Major Tomcat. It's time to leave the tree branch if you dare. Oh my god, this is amazing! Where, where is RJ City right now? He needs this. Ground control to Major Tomcat. I'm so happy I chose Animal Whisperer now. Meow. Meow. All right, you really made the grade. <gasps> is he mine? <gasps> he is. Uh... <gasps> He's got a little fucking hat on. No, he does not. Where I need to see him. I need to get closer. He's got, I cannot get any closer. He's got a little bandana and a little hat. Major Tomcat is my favorite. This is my favorite thing I've ever done. Let's go in here. I'm saving. Major Tomcat is mine forever. Ooh, syringes. Focus item. Liquid time. Nice. Medical crate. Wait, what? Drug stash. Okay. I'm in love right now. He's got a little hat and a little cat bandana. I don't know what he does or why I have him. Jerry, little brother. How goes that deal use your blood? You dry gulch them hotlanders yet? Yeah, we did. What? No! No! Oh, if I ever catch who did this! 
It was Dad! me! Dad! Every last one of them! Dad! You hear me? My brother will be avenged! Ah. Fixer upper? I got an I got a Steam achievement. What? I'm in love with this game, guys. I'm in love with this game so far. I uh, I saw your message earlier. I meant, I meant to answer Ty Five like you were asking what my opinion was after this point. Welcome, Rangers. You may approach the Patreon. Two. When there were fifty. Uh, three. I think you mean. Cold logic How says dare you I not count Major Tomcat? Away. That there aren't enough of you left to do the job at hand. But that Dorsey ambush was my fault. What? And I owe you more than explanations and apologies. Yeah, you do. So, here's something more tangible. The Dorseys didn't just attack you. They attacked my city. This one was... Trying to burn down our jail. If you want some vengeance for Give me the vengeance. To you, Give he's me the vengeance. yours. Yeah. Thanks. Kill the Dorsey. Don't mind if we do. Um, he's your prisoner. You can have it. Nope, we'll take it. Thanks. Be my guest. Well done. I wish I could give you all the Dorseys. And maybe, before all this is over, I will. But for now, let me address your immediate needs. In addition to this base and the aid I promised your general, mm. I'll be giving you the resources to return your force to full strength. Recruiting, training, and equipping. That's right. It's not enough. I know. The men and women you lost can never be replaced. Damn. But it's what I can give you. I hope you'll accept it. Oh! Let's go! Thank you, Patriarch. Um, we appreciate anything you can do for us. Um, better than nothing. As long as our deal is still in place, no deal. If the ambush was your fault, then you owe us. Give us our own supplies and let us go home. No, no. No, no. It's better than nothing, and this is as long as our deal is still in place. But he just said it was his fault, so... I'll take it. But I ain't gonna be... I'm not gonna kiss his ass. The deal's still in place. Then we're good. You help me, I help Arizona. Yep. And the flame of civilization spreads its warm glow a little further into the night. That's what we all want. Right. Right? Yep. Now. <sighs> introduction. Oh, shit. My name is Saul Buchanan. Okay. I own Colorado. Though you'll meet some who disagree. Oh, this base clearly. is your new home. All right. From here, you'll aid my people okay. and, more importantly, do the job I brought you here to do. Right. Now, yes, Joe. Pardon, uh -huh. Patriarch. It's Daisy. What? An update on the Garden of the Daisy. Gods. Daisy. All right. Sorry, Rangers. Still putting out for I guess we'll have to hold off on Doing my best of waiting for you inside. Darius Kwan of the Marshals okay. and my old friend Sergei Gretzky. Okay. Go see him. Okay. I'll be in when I'm done here. Queens, the story in this game and in the games like this is where it's at. The story is what makes these games. The stories and the choices and the consequences, the effect you have on the world that you are playing in, that is what makes them so fun. The graphics, I feel like, and the play style is a compromise to make it no, to allow you to focus on the story that much and in that way. It's, a, it's amazing. What's this big thing right here? An old with a one pistol. Diligent Joe. Major Oh my god, Major Tomcat. Let's talk. Purr. He fixes his steely gaze upon you and then wiggles his tail expectantly. Um, you deserve a scritch behind the hat, Major Tomcat. <gasps> never. I would never dismiss him. Never, 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 never. Yep, give him a little scritch behind the hat. Oh, 
I'm good. I'm sold, man. All right, let's get back to the mission, Ranger. I love that I made him like an honorary ranger. Adamant, hello? <laughs> Who are you? Diligent uh -huh. Joe? Immacu Immaculate? What? Nods, okay. Hello, Diligent Joe. Pleased to meet you, rangers. All right, let's go inside. Actually, let's, wait, can I? You're the leader there, lead. Jesus. Welcome, Rangers. I'm Marshal Darius Kwan, and this here's Sergei Gretzky. Okay. Good to meet you, Rangers. Glad to see some friendly faces. Been rough around here these Do last few days. we need the days. alarm going off? Dorsey's attacked us, too. <laughs> Snuck inside Colorado Springs and killed a lot of people. Situation's under control now. Mostly. What were they after? Why are these alarms going off? No idea. Something must we have don't triggered know. the old security system. Trouble is, there's a bunch of angry robots guarding the computer that Great. shuts them off. Great. How you deal with them is your call. Your base. Your rules. You just giving us this base? Cool. Um, so this place is ours now. Angry robots. Why are there angry robots? Alright. Yep. Noisy alarms and all. Got it. Courtesy of the patriarch. Got it. We can talk more once we get a little peace and quiet. Yeah. No Word good. of warning with those servitors. They tend the to go nuts. The security computer is up those stairs. Okay. Orders. You can shut off the alarm from there. Oh my god. Can I? Toaster. Cold food. Alright, we'll go upstairs. Hopefully, and that will just do it. Okay, let me go away. Let me just go away from the from the alarms for a moment and pause. And if you guys would allow me, please, a moment to top off my coffee and order some breakfast and get ready to continue playing some more Wasteland. I love this game. It is as good as I knew it was gonna be. I, listen, I have always loved the, the Fallout series, even the ones that suck. And I always knew that Fallout was based off of the original Wasteland. The original game, Wasteland, was the inspiration for the Fallout series. So they've always been very, very closely connected and kind of, um, like, uh, uh, sp sp like, sp not, I don't want to say spiritual successors necessarily of each other, but, like, they, they always seem to use the same universe, basically. Um, and I played Wasteland 2, I knew it was great. I have been excited about Wasteland 3, and it kind of surprised me. I I felt like I'd been waiting years for it to come out. So you just kind of forget about them, and then all of a sudden it was just out. And I was like, oh, it's out. Like, it's here, and it's done. And I knew I was going to love it. Like, I can usually tell. I'm like, yeah, this is going to be what I like. But so far, it has exceeded my expectations, and I'm having a great time. So I'm going to keep playing. Probably stream overtime a little bit today. It's Saturday. I, this is literally all I want to do. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. So let me top off my coffee. I'm going to order some breakfast. I'm going to stretch. You should do the same. Maybe get some water. Hydrate a little bit. It's good for you. Stretch and hydrate. Like it's great advice. That's what like people want advice, but I'm like, man, you can't give people specific advice because everybody needs different things, you know, but there's you, but recommending and suggesting that you hydrate and you stretch, it's good for everybody. It's never going to hurt anyone, you know? Like, those are good. Those are good bits of advice. So that's what I recommend you do while I'm on this break. I'll be right back in just a few minutes, guys.
<laughs> All right, guys, I'm back. I was, I, I didn't see you guys being funny in the chat when, uh, <laughs> when the alarms were going off. <laughs> All right, everybody good? Mm. Coffee has been topped off. I put my coffee down. I don't know if you guys saw me walk by, I put my coffee down, and then I went right here. And I did a bunch of stretches, mainly for my hamstrings and my hips, because I feel like that's what gets fucked up the most when you just sit in a chair, right? At least for me, it does. I don't know about you guys, but for me, it does. And, uh... I feel so much better. I literally feel like everything... I just feel more awake. I feel... It makes stuff stop hurting that I didn't even realize was hurting. Alright, this is gonna be really annoying until these... Alarms are off. A servitor bot, servitor bot, servitor bot. It said they tend to go insane when you what? When you tell them to do what? To follow orders? What did you say? He gave me a bit of advice. Ah, fuck it, we'll figure it out. What's that? Oh no. I rave alarm. Amazing. Amazing. Give authorization or you will be path. You'll be what? <laughs> You'll be what? Oh my god. Sneaky shit. <clears throat> what do I have? Your security system is showing signs of neglect. We we are from IT. We're here to fix you. Let's let's use that sneaky shit. Let's use that. <laughs> Art. <laughs> oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> this game is funny. <laughs> Gilbermint. <laughs> it worked. I don't know what I did, but I talked to them and it worked. Radio setting. Right here, let's get this one. And see, Billy Baru's got lock picking, and we get good stuff. Ooh, a lore book and a what? 50 cans of Aquanet? I don't know what that is, but. Loot it all. I want to have Shirk get nerd stuff. I think I'll like it. What is happening? Why am I stuck? Huh? What the hell? It's stuck. Unstick! I say. All of a sudden, isn't working. Come on. What do we? Uh, do, oh, I bet I needed to do this. Continue. Uh, wait, accessing item options. Okay, inventory, view stats. Mm-hmm. Any weapon can be broken down into spare parts by field stripping it. Okay, if you have a very low barter skill, you can sometimes get better prices from the merchants for the parts uh, than the weapon itself. With the scrounger, has the chance to grant weapon mods. Ooh. I can't wait till I can start adding more people to my party. 
But they were saying you don't want to make someone able to do everything. You you want your people you have to specialize because they're specialists. That's what they are. Um, but you have a well-rounded party. I think you can have up to six. Like, it's pretty cool. It prioritizes, like, having a party with good synergy rather than having a character that's just, you know, a badass at everything. Can we go now? What is this? It's totally, like, jacked up. I'm just gonna reload. I should be able to do that same voice or um, sneaky shit again. Alright, let's do it again. Shirk, sure, you can talk to them. What? What are you doing? Why am I freezing? What the fuck is going on? Let's just reload the game. Something's going on. It's acting, it's acting weird. What up, Sam? Yeah, you get to hear the accent again. You get to hear the accent again. Get ready. The whole UI was just disappearing, and I wasn't able to click anything or move anyone or select anyone. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't giving me any of that. Let's have a sip of coffee, though. That we can do. The Filipino bots broke the game. I cannot express to you how funny that was to me. Like, I don't even know why. Just hit continue, it should load the most recent save. And we can have a little convo with the robots again and hopefully not have weird shit happen. Alarm! I rape alarm. <laughs> you will be what? I still don't know what he says. Um, sticky shit. We're here to fix you. In 110 years. That's what I was saying about the accents and stuff. These robots existed and then it's still been 110 years since they were built. All right, that's how long it's been for them. So it's been quite a long time after this supposed end of the world. Okay. They were like, fix us and then get out. They're not gonna, they're, we're gonna have to probably, we need to shut them down. Uh huh. Major Tomcat. He's so cute. Nuts. Ooh, in the wasteland, blah blah blah. Installing blah blah blah. I think this is what caused it to get wonky last time. Install weapon on the mod. Da, 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 da. Uh huh. Okay. I'm kind of skimming over this stuff right now. But I think I basically understand. 
for what it's asking of me. That's a good thing. Okay, yeah, continue, 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 continue. You cannot wear that. Scout armor. Okay, you cannot wear those. But, oh Billy. Hmm. I think I like the scout pants better. I think I'd rather have the combat speed. It doesn't have, you know, the armor boost as the others, but, uh... This one... Ooh, this is even better, though, right here. Now this... Whoa. All right. Billy. <laughs> He's ridiculous. Alright. Keep searching things. Alright, let's uh let's talk to this thing right here. Well, it's dusty and old, but when you press the power button, it flickers to life, the computer beeps and whirs for the first time in years. Take care who me. Thanks for hanging out, man. I appreciate you. Ooh, take the littles to the beach. We'll have fun. Enjoy yourself. And uh, again, thank you for spending some time in my stream. I appreciate it. All right, security. Eventually you query them in, but duh, it replies. Command empty. Designate new command. Yeah, install myself as command. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Shirk and Billy Baru are in charge. Well done, Rangers. Glad well to see the place up and running. Major Tomcat, he's so cute. The... Now, where were we? Now. Oh, yes. The reason you're here. Which is? As you may know, I have a daughter and two sons. Liberty, Valor, and Victory. Two of them conspired okay. against me, and the third blackens the Buchanan name with every breath he takes. Consequently, I banished him. Consequently, okay. They've been skulking in the shadows ever since. But lately, there's been rumors that I'm on my last legs. Lies, of course. Lies. But apparently my dear children believe them, and they've started making new plans. All right. You looking for protection? Are you asking us to become assassins? You need us to round them up? Um, you want us to act as emissaries to your children? Make peace? What do you want from us? Um... What you need for... Uh, what, do you, yeah, what, are you, what are you asking? What are you asking? Um, he wants to round him up. Ain't you smart. I'm not worried about my children defeating me, Rangers. They won't. Not even Liberty. What worries me is the destruction they'll wreak as they fail. Mm. They'll tear my land and my people to shreds. They'll burn everything I've accomplished to mm. ash. That's why they have to be stopped before they can start. That's why you, Rangers, have to find them and bring them home to me ASAP. How much you paying? And when I say bring them home, I mean bring them home a lot. Listen. They're my blood. Kill them and we'll have a problem. Do I make myself clear? Mm. What if taking them alive is impossible? You've already done the impossible by making it here. Cop out. I trust you. No. Find a way to make it possible. Now, let me tell you where they are. Victories hold up in Aspen. The psychopath. Valor's <laughs> under the protection of the Gippers in Denver. Okay. And Liberty's raising an army against me somewhere out on the eastern Jesus. plains. Anything else you need to know? Um, we'll need more background on your kids before we go after them. We'll have a few things we'd like to ask about the Dorsey's in the ambush. 
Yeah, I'd like to ask a few uh, things. Who are the Dorseys? The last dregs of a treacherous family. Thought I'd wipe them out years ago, but... <sighs> Mistakes linger, Rangers. I know that better than most. Okay. Do you think Vic Val, Vic Val or Liberty, Vic Val or Lib, were behind the attack on our convoy? Possibly, but I know the Dorsey's from the old days. They don't take orders well. Then again, I wouldn't have guessed they'd have the guts to attack both you and Colorado Springs at the same time. So somebody put some fire in them. Why, why do you say the ambush was your fault? My staff and I coordinated the details of your arrival using coded transmissions on radio frequencies we thought were secure. Mm-hmm. Obviously, they were not. And you paid for Wow! Them. I take full responsibility. You do owe me! Good. What else do you need? Um, I need more in info on the kids. What do you want to know? Uh, for one thing, you must have plenty of competent people in Colorado. Why ask us to deal with your children? Fair question. Divided loyalty, that's why. What up, Art? Or, sorry, I not Art, my Alex. Guards, but they don't leave my side. Ever. Everybody else. Everybody else is making plans for when I'm gone. The Hundred Families, the Gippers, the Marshals. They're all out for themselves. It's all the factions. And they know my kids These games always have heads. warring factions, and who you help and what you do is like, like one of the main functions of the game. And I can't wait. Um. <clears throat> Any Colorado and I send to bring Vic, Val, and Libby back home might think they'll get a better deal elsewhere. Hmm. But not you. I'm the only one who can save your people. Nobody else can get supplies to Arizona before they starve to death. I don't know if I like that holding him holding that over my head. That's why it's you who's doing this. You've got the only loyalty that works. The loyalty of self-interest. All right, what do we know about victory, valor, liberty? Let's go. Hmm. Boy's never been right in the head. <laughs> Great. Since he was a baby, he'd torture cats, no! terrorize the servants, set the house on Major fire. Major Tomcat just growled. He's only got worse. The things he's done to the women he finds. Anyway, I finally had enough and put the little monster under house arrest up in Aspen. I guess they weren't prepared because wow. he escaped a while ago and then came back with a gang of freaks and turned the place into a slaughter. We gotta kill him, man. Now he's on the radio. Laughing about what he's gonna do to his hostages and daring me to come after him. Great, he sounds fun. Yeah. He, claims he's captured some rangers Ooh. as well. That makes me want to go to him first, especially. All right, there were other survivors. That's great news. He better not hurt those rangers. And if he does, you're still bringing him home alive, no matter what. Remember? Mm -mm -mm. What kind of man is Valor then? <sighs> Soft, spoiled, Ooh. fiddled with computers all day instead of learning the arts of diplomacy and war. Finally packed him off when he accidentally crashed my <laughs> security systems right before his sister's little coup attempt. Okay. Made him my official ambassador to the Gippers, hoping he'd do to their systems what he'd done to mine. Wow. That was a mistake. He took his revenge by... Dude, why you want your kids alive? I don't understand. <laughs> ...to my city. They're clearly not going to give you that luxury. Well, like, what makes you think you're going to maintain this hold over them? See, already I want to betray him. But he's like, we can only help the rangers. Bullshit. If you ain't getting supplies in in or out, and when you're dead, someone, someone else will be able to do it. So already I'm like, mm, Mr. Slaughterhouse Man, I'm not feeling. He needs to go. If he tortures cats, done. No mercy. Don't worry, Major Tomcat. See, I got his back. No oil means no heat, no light, and no food for my people. So getting Valor back and resuming oil shipments from the Gippers has to happen now. So Valor isn't dangerous? No, but the Gippers are tough I and see. well armed. And Denver's a death trap. 
I see. Tell us about Liberty. Liberty's got more brains and cunning than both her brothers put Great. together. She's the only one who could actually run Colorado. Problem is, she'd run it as a goddamn slave state. Everyone in chains. Everyone working for her. Damn. Wouldn't worry about her for now, though. Best to wait until you got a little more fire. All right, all right. She's going to be well protected. You're expecting her to try to usurp you? <sighs> She's already tried once. Damn. Listen, guy, you are not going to control your kids. Steps before we chased her off. She's been licking her wounds out east ever since. Thanks for the info. We'll do our best. You'd better. Anything else? Um, I got... I got no barter. Damn. I wish I had at least a tiny bit, but thank you for the briefing. Of course. Now, if you want a chance to impress me, maybe get a little payback. Okay. That call I got outside was from Sheriff Daisy, the head of the marshals in Colorado Springs. Okay. I'm checking my food, guys. I'm checking my food. One moment. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a while. Not not in a bad way, just it just will be. But that's fine. I'm so oh my god, I'm so happy right now, guys. Thank you all for being here, hanging out with me. Fell apart. Why don't you go give her a hand? Show us what the Rangers can do. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a piece of cake. Dorsey's, this'll be a pleasure. Enjoy yourselves, Rangers. Just don't get killed. I want a return on my investment. What up, Diana? You are not late, Diana. You arrived precisely when you mean to. That goes for everyone. That's also why, like, there's always replays for later. And I feel like it's good to not always necessarily catch 100% of everything all the time. So that when you, like, have time to watch and you want something to be entertained by but maybe I'm not live in that exact moment there's probably plenty of other stuff that you can watch that you hopefully haven't seen yet it is new and fresh you know and then you can pay the tax on those videos as well it all works out trust me there's it's a balance to all things all right let's move out home away from home all right can I I need to trade can I trade can I do more things if I can't start recruiting other people soon, I'm gonna have to give one of my people the barter skill. Major Tomcat. All right, uh, new mission, continue. Wow, mission game, game saved. Okay, primary missions, progress. progress the main story. Secondary missions are optional side quests. You just received a primary mission, this one. Wait. Okay. We got no secondary missions, though. Perfect. God damn! Level 9, 19, and 17. Jesus. Damn. But this one's first, right here. Cornered rats. Shortly before we, we arrived at Peterson Air Force Base, a large group of Dorseys attacked Colorado Spring. The attack failed, and most of the holdouts are holed up in the Garden of the Gods. The Patriarch asked us to help his marshals deal with them. Reward, Ranger HQ, Brig Warden, Merc Armor, Merc Helmet, and Merc Leggings. Hell yeah. Talk to the Sheriff Daisy uh, in downtown Colorado Springs. Okay. We can earn him some goodwill. Well, it's really the only thing we can do right now, so we might as well get on it. All right, I don't have anybody that that can help. So, Rangers, come talk to me when you've got them. Ooh. Oh wait, discuss staffing and recruiting. Oh yeah, yeah. Kind of I want to talk about that too. Let's talk. Good job, Rangers. Thanks. Nice to be able to hear ourselves think again. Yeah. 
And now that it's quiet enough to talk, let me reintroduce you to the great Sergei Gretsky. It's okay. Who's going to be helping you with personnel. Okay. Hi again, Rangers. Oh, this feels Damn good. sorry about your people. But now that you're here, we'll do what we can to get you back on your feet and find you some new recruits. Just like the Patriarch promised you. Hell yeah. Okay. And I already got you one of the best. Meet Marcelo Gonzalez. All right. Electronics wizard, radio technician. Perfect. And former dispatcher for the marshals. He'll be your radio operator. Yeah. Howdy, Rangers. What up? Uh, while you were dealing with the alarms, I took the liberty of installing a combat AI in your vehicle. Okay. Should help you out. If you want to chat, I'll be in the operations room getting things up and running. Okay. Should be more recruits arriving soon. Ready to tell me how you want to fill out more your squad? More than four can be rangers. The other two slots may be filled by companions, such as Marshal Quan. Okay. Companions are unique embassies who aren't officially rangers, but want to help out all the same. You'll find plenty of companions out on your journeys through Colorado. Okay, so you get up to four can be rangers. We count as two, so we can get two more rangers and then two companions that you find outside that are not rangers. Got it? Um, before we get to all that, we've got questions. Show us who you've got lined up. Yeah, we got we got questions. I got questions. Of course. Ask away. Can you and Quan tell us more about yourselves? Yeah, if Quan can be a companion, I want to know all about him. And this guy, to be honest. Uh, well. Yeah? <laughs> well, Sergey won't blow his own horn, so I'll do it for him. Ew. He's Colorado's Don't greatest say it warrior. Like that. Fought by the Patriarch's side from the beginning and saved the old man's life about a hundred times, right, Sergey? 75. Tops. Oh, so modest. Now, let me tell you about Mr. Slick here. Okay. Nobody knows the streets and alleys of Colorado Springs or the people that live there better than Dashing Darius Quan. Dashing Darius Quan. You're too kind, Sergey. All right, these two guys are, they're definitely gay for each other. In the best way. I need to just... I, I don't want to separate them. If I bring one, I want to bring the other. They clearly really like each other. Got it? Um, what was the deal with the alarms and robots? Not sure exactly. We came by a week and a half ago, and it was stone quiet. Okay. We were going to get the place cleaned up before you got here. But then the Dorseys attacked the city, so it got put on the back burner. Mm -hmm. Something must have triggered the security systems between then and now. Mm -hmm. Could have been anything. Yeah, I was getting a little it's itchy like you guys doing volunteered. the same old, same old in the marshals. And retirement was driving me stir-crazy. Just sitting around listening to the paint peel. I jumped at the chance to help you folks out. Okay, you both seem, seem awful eager to help a group of unknown outsiders. Why are you really here? It's no lie that I've been looking to leave the marshals, but mm -hmm. you're right. That's not the whole story. The Patriarch asked me to keep an eye on you, so here I am. Okay. And I am truly sick of Wow, retirement. okay, so they, they got but, called in as a favor. Yeah, I'm doing the Patriarch a favor, too. All right, so you're spies. Um, well, Let's say... Liaison. Liaison. The okay. Patriarch wants you to succeed, and he knows it's not going to be easy. All right. You don't know the politics. You don't know the personalities. Okay. Who hates who? It's true. Where the bodies are buried. <clears throat> they are good, like, advisors, and I would need that. We are outsiders. We don't know the lay of the land. That's where we come in. We're here to make sure you don't make too many rookie mistakes. Step on the wrong toes. Got it. And yeah, we're supposed to report back to the Patriarch about how you're doing. But you didn't really expect And they're being completely up front about that. So I respect it and I'm okay with it. How long has this place been abandoned? Patriarch chased out the last big gang maybe 10 years back. Before that, all kinds of bandits, militias, and cults have lived here since the deluge. What up, Sam? Recently, it's been mostly outlaws and refugees. We should check around to see if there are any... Current occupants. Hmm. Current. Yeah, we haven't even cleared out this building yet. Could be what set off the alarms. Yeah, do we want to do that? <laughs> like, do we want to, like, maybe clear out our own base first? What is the deluge? The deluge. Around these parts, we call the nuclear apocalypse the deluge of fire. Okay. Because, well, that's what it so was. So there was a nuclear apocalypse, yes. Same, see, same as Fallout. Noah's flood was the deluge of water. Okay. The nukes. Were the deluge of fire. Uh-huh. 
What was the radio operator saying about putting combat AI in our vehicle? Gonzalez? He's a whiz with stuff like that. The AI will allow you to give the vehicle orders in combat without having to be inside it. Basically, it'll become another member of your squad. Cool. All right, that's all okay. for questions. What's next? Show us what you got lined up. My advice is to put together a squad with complementary skills. Nobody can be great at everything. Right. So pick recruits who are good at things your current team isn't. Right. And you can always round out your squad with folks you meet along the way. Right. Keep that in mind when you're choosing from the recruits I've rounded up. I will. Look how cute Billy Baru is. What? Look at all these recruits. Bison Bill, Banshee. <clears throat> okay, 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 hold on. Trooper, trooper, Sasquatch. Oh, shit. Let's see, he's melee. Ooh, Danny smiles. Good at barter, small arms, and a hard ass. <clears throat> he's not maybe a bad, a bad guy. That's maybe, that's maybe a good one. Nerd stuff, sneaky shit, automatic. We got sneaky shit covered. <clears throat> we got this covered. Big guns, first aid, and explosives. Explosives. Doc Nails, he's a pretty good, that's a pretty good compliment now. We need a first aid, we need a healer, big time. Small arms, toast repair, and weird size. This guy, this guy. Professor Higgs and Doc. I want both. I want to. I want to get them both. But I'm gonna recruit this guy first because small arms. He, his, the skills are also high. Like he's starting pretty decent with all three. I want all of them. Toaster repair and weird science. The toaster repair is a thing. Uh, like there's toasters around the world to repair, and you get like special things, but you can only. Get them. And small arms is decent. It's close range. Like, I feel like he'll be fun to keep with me. But, actually, let's get Doc Nails first and then get Professor Higgs if we can. Because I need the first aid. So, Professor... Or, sorry, Doc Nails. Look at him. He's pretty cool. We'll take him. There we go. And then I can get Professor Higgs, I think. And But you know what? Sadly, that's still nobody. Who's got barter? Anyone got barter? You've got one, two. Danny smiles. Barter two, small arms, and a hard ass. Nah, it's gotta be Professor Higgs. It's gotta be. <laughs> Is it like the hot plates? Oh my god, CM Pep remembers the hot plates. And that was on Shayna's stream. Her hot plate collection? Kind of, yeah. Only you can repair them and get stuff from them. Hard ass one. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Professor Higgs here. He's my little inventor. He's my little weird guy. I dig it. Energy, fire, cold, and explosion damage. Right. Ignores. Okay, elemental weapons ignore armor entirely, but go t purely off of the elemental damage type. En enemies are often weak to some elemental damage type and resistant to others. Right. That goes for everything. Okay, okay, okay. Uh-huh. Right. Okay. I'm ready. Listen, I can get you all the fighting troops you need, but if you meet any talented people in your That's travels, what the other two slots are for. Don't hesitate to sign them up. Now that we've got that sorted, let's talk about the next steps. Uh-huh. Now, you're the boss here. I'm the boss. So I'm not going to tell you what to do, but okay. getting this place up and running wouldn't be a bad place to start. Yep. That means surveying the base and finding specialists to staff it. Got it. Surveying the base sounds good. Perfect. That'll give you a chance to see if any of the junk around here is worth keeping before I toss it all out. Okay. After that, you might want to give Sheriff Daisy a hand. If you impress her... Maybe she'll hook you up with some specialist for the base. Got it. Anyway, your call. Anyway. Colorado Springs is straight out the main gate. If 
you want to go to Denver or Aspen, just hop back in your car and go out the way you came in. Okay. Uh, thanks for that info. Uh, one sec. Forgive me for saying so, but I'm guessing you folks are going to need as much help in the yeah, field. Yeah, Marshal Kwan, I would like that. You. So, what if I joined your squad? Yep. At least until you find your feet. Yep. Uh, what do you have to offer us? Well, I know this city like the back of my hand. And this city knows me. Damn. My time in the Marshals means I've got connections and trusted informants everywhere. I like it. Plus, I'm a sure shot and a decent scrapper. Okay. And, though it hurts my civic pride to say it, there are places around here where those things might come in handy. All right, we could use the help. Great. I'm at your disposal. Love it. Lead the way. <coughs> cool. Marshal Kwan, you've recruited our first companion. They are a unique kind of squad member. Unlike the rangers you create, companions are the pre are pre-made characters that have their own personality and agenda. Piss them off and they could leave you high and dry. Companions, too. You can have up to six characters in your squad. Four of them can be ranger recruits. Wait. Leaving at least two spots open for companions. Yeah, 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 yeah. Four of them, including me. Right. So what they're saying, basically, is the companions aren't, aren't required to stay with you. They can get pissed off and just leave. All right. Can you... Yeah, we got attributes and skills to level up. Okay, starting at level three, you will earn one attribute point per level. Attributes always cost one point to upgrade. Attributes are the source of all your vital stats. You want to live longer, run faster, shoot straighter, hit harder. There's an attribute for that. Got it. So, oh, my. See, I love intelligence. It just keeps making that crit go up. And you, you gain... One skill points every two intelligence. Oh my god, yes. And so that will be more. Let's do it. Let's just push it a little further. Nice. Confirm. Sniper rifle. Now that will take... How much? Upgrade cost two? Okay. Well, sneaky shit. Animal whisperer. I don't, like, I got Major Tomcat, like, I'm good. Let's, wait, 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 back. Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. We can confirm that for now. Um, see, kiss, but see, his sneaky shit is, I don't like that. I don't like that he also has that. But I don't really have a choice right now. He just wants to help, and and that what that means is I can replace him, eventually. But he's a good one to have right now, and he's just an extra hand. Like it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, now Shirk, you can still. I'm just wondering if I should just uh, give it to Shirk, but I just feel like it's a waste right now. I'm going full Animal Whisperer right now. Because what does it allow? Spirit Animal. What? Beast Ally brings something primal and pure in you. What? Training, right or wrong, you have an uncommon talent for teaching animals to murder? I mean, okay. Yeah, I like it. You can always respect them as well, so nobody panic. All right, I say we make old Doc Nails here hit hard with his big guns and just leave him at like that for now. Confirm. And then Professor Higgs, same with you. I want to make you guys get your combat skills up because we got to take you out into the real world now. We've got these backup skills. We can kind of focus on those, but 
Otherwise, yeah. Perfect. Everyone's ready to go. Oh my god, I love it. This kitty's got claws. Nice. Gross. There it is. Smoke grenade. Antidote. What does he have right there? Oh, just a, he already has the injury kit. Okay. Same. You can have the snowballs. Okay. Mm. There it is. There you go. Don't worry, we'll get more armor for you guys. We'll get it. So what is this? Assault, assault, sniper, rocket. Is that a count as big guns or can he use this? Hmm. Nah, his the one he's got's way, way higher. Not as likely to hit and or crit, but I mean, it's a it's a heavy machine gun as opposed to a mangler rocket, but I'd rather take the higher damage for now. We'll see how it plays out. We'll see how it works. So this is the Patriarch's Marshals right here. Right? Okay, that's who we're helping, and then our just overall fame in the world, I guess. Full house. Um, recruit personnel for Ranger HQ. Brig Jailer, a med bay doctor, an armory quartermaster, and a garage mechanic. Okay. Sheriff Daisy, head of Colorado, um, who can be found in downtown Colorado Springs. Okay. That's what I want to work on right now. What's that? Doc Nails. What am I hearing? Huh. The garage. We get this cleaned out, you can put your truck in here. <laughs> put a truck in here. Ooh, go lock pick that Billy Baru. Money, money. Yeah. Sick of dodging reckless drivers? Fed up with paying a fortune to shady mechanics that never actually fix your car? Consolidated Atomics has the answer. Introducing Hermes, the revolutionary vehicle AI that's an expert driver, navigator, and auto mechanic. Amazing. About the basis systems, all seems normal right now. Uh, examine most recent activity logs. Uh, oh, Jesus. What? A giant server wipe that occurred decades ago. Okay. Uh, vehicle lifts. They are all unresponsive. Recall service elevator platform. Please wait. What? Mechanical failure reported. A servitor drone has been issued to re a repair order. Okay. Step away. Alright. Let's save before we talk to this thing so that it doesn't kill me, hopefully. This enormous spider-like robot is in bad shape. It twitches in a puddle of its own fluids. Uh, it's casing dented and riddled with bullet holes. Okay. Judging by the scrape marks on the floor, it looks like someone dragged it into the garage from somewhere else. Uh, a mechanic could fix it, but we don't have that. 
be recognized as a slicer dicer pre-apocalypse military robot. It appears to have been badly damaged in a firefight and is missing some of its weapons. Upon closer inspections, you note that the, some of the bullet holes have been patched and several of the legs show signs of recent welding. The slicer dicer's main access panel is open, revealing its wiring and power plant. It's clear that someone has been trying to repair the robot. Okay, leave it alone for now. What's happening? Hello? This corpse of a young woman lies at your feet, her body contorted in an unnatural angle. Judging by the smell, she's been here a while. Nice. First aid too, determine how she died. The body's unnatural position suggests some kind of seizure. Okay. And there are signs of discoloration on her face, indicative of heart failure. Interesting. Someone just, they just left her here. Heavy metal spanners gripped tightly in her right hand. The metal is discolored and scorch marks blacken her fingertips. It looks to you like a textbook case of electrocution. Examine it. Uh, she's wearing a patchwork jumpsuit and a leather tool belt. Her pockets are crammed with fuses, bundles of wire, and bits of circuit boards. Looks like this wastelander made her living by scavenging and repairing electronics. She would have felt right at home in an old garage like this. Damn. That's how she died. Right there. What's this? Pick lock. Get in there, Billy. This is why you gotta have a lock picker, man. It's like... Not negotiable. Non-negotiable. You gotta have it. Ah, level three? I don't have that. Ooh. Boo. Come on, everyone. What's out here? What's this? Is this our... Our truck? We just get in it and go? Okay. the trap, okay? Actually, I think Shirk has the highest perception. She should probably what go in front. What a stink. Somebody's been using this med bay for a morgue. Ugh. They're taking an ocean of bleach to get it ready for customers. Yeah. This desiccated husk of a man is little more than a skeleton covered in papery skin. First aid, search for a cause of death. Looks like a simple case of starvation and dehydration, but the corpse's ankles and wrists so show signs of scarring, as if he was chained up for a while. Hmm. It's a mystery, guys. This female corpse is bloated and putrefied. One of her arms is entirely missing. Black ichor oozes from her swollen torso. First aid, search for the cause of death. Looks like the missing arm had nothing to do with the woman's demise. It has been expertly removed and stitched up long before she died. Instead, she seems to have died of an infection or illness. You notice the same scarring on her ankles and wrists as the other corpses, most likely from manacles. Torn skin suggests that they were frequently moved. Um, anything else? Looks like the missing arm, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay. Leave me. Pile of corpses. These people died in a variety of ways, most of them violent. Bullet holes, crushed skull, cut throat. They all have the same scarring. Leathery corpse is missing several digits in a... Oh, God. Looks like exposure to extreme cold took this person... Uh, took this person's missing extremities. Yep, same scarring, but it wasn't the cold. Open wounds across his back indicate that he was whipped to death. Let's find the same scarring. Da, da, da. Who was in here and what were they doing? We already, oh, sorry, we already looked at him. Pick lock. Impossible. Alright. Never mind. Okay, 
Air Toaster. Damn it, it's level three. Later, Loco. Enjoy your rest, my man. Um, where Shane was King just, but this time just what? Oh, another grappling. I was like, I was like, what was the first message I missed? <laughs> Jesus. Let's go see what's in here. Cold food. This must have been the mess hall. Better get this up and running pronto. Keeping your people well fed is probably the easiest way to keep them loyal. Okay, we'll search him up in just a second. Actually, let's just do him right now. Hello? Please, don't shoot. All right, the woman is gaunt. Her, clo her clothes ragged. She's surrounded by a group of bedraggled vagrants who watch you with fear and mistrust. Who? All right, all right, relax. Who are you? You're not dressed like the marshals. We're the rangers. Who are you? I'm Del Hackett, and I... Well, uh, I speak for she these She looks people. cool. I like her. We've been living here for months, and we've got nowhere to go. Only if you agree to help. Please, will you let us stay? Bad idea. I've been in their shoes, but this is a military base. If we have squatters everywhere, it'll be hard to keep discipline. Okay. Your recruits won't like it either. Maybe there's a compromise. Come on. The Patriarch's people don't care about people like us. But you're not beholden to them. Mm-hmm. Um, did you set off the security system? Not intentionally. Mm. The Patriarch's people drove up to the base a few days ago, so we hid in here for a while. Then when Andy went to check if they left, all the doors slammed shut and the alarms started whooping. Don't know what happened. Been living in these ruins for weeks and we never set anything off before. Where are you from? We all farmed in the border country between Colorado and the Plains. Thought we were safe out there, under the oh, Patriarch's Oh shit, my food's protection. here! Let me go grab my food, guys. We all farmed in the border country between Colorado and the Plains, though we thought we were safe out there. Back then, the gangs feared the Patriarch. <laughs> Not anymore. Not They'd anymore. They'd greenhouses and killed everyone um, who tried okay, to Okay, I'll be right back. Let me grab my food. No Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. For any of us. Oh. And Ty Five, there's a video of me super kicking Shayna at an Invicta photo shoot, if I recall. So that exists. Doesn't that count? That counts.
Okay. Guys, I'm back. We can pick. Sorry I had to leave right in the middle of dialogue, but I had to get food. I have to eat. Also, I'm going to be streaming for longer than five hours today, so I'm going to make sure that I keep my energy up. And it's smart to take breaks. I feel like I, I, I aim for like every 60 to 90 minutes, take at least a five minute break. It's just good for you. I think that's a good thing that it, everyone should do. Your body will thank you. Uh, anyway, we got refugees, and I'm not sure how I'm going to handle them yet. Can't you go live? Can't you go live in the city? Can't you go live in the city? Um, you can't go live in the city. We're not welcome there. They already have too right. many mouths to feed. Right. And more are always coming. Right. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna eat right in front of them. Mm. Oh, wow. It is literally just gonna be like... Like, yes or no. I'm sure if you let them stay, the soldiers don't like it. It's gonna be hard to get, to get discipline. Or to keep discipline but also like if I let them stay maybe they will help you know like that's this is how I feel about it I think I'm gonna let them stay I kind of I'm not like this patriarch guy I don't know how I feel about him okay All right. And I run this show now, so you can stay. Your call won't make yep. the volunteers happy, but the patriarch put you in charge. See? Not them. You're goddamn right. You said yes. Yes, uh, I did. Well, I was sure you wouldn't. Well, you're wrong. We won't be any trouble, I promise, and, and we'll help out See? wherever we can. <sighs> Thank you for giving us a chance. Oh, and uh, one of our people is missing, oh. Andy. If you find him hiding out somewhere, <laughs> you Andy? send him back to us. Andy? Andy? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. All right, there we go. My cord got stuck. Hear that, everyone? We gotta make ourselves yeah. useful around no, here. I, yeah, I don't want. I don't. Don't make me regret my decision. Okay. Hmm. I wish more folks were like you, Lady. Sure was kind of you to let us stay. Yeah. Well. dark y'all so get ready like brace yourselves for real if you're watching this thinking it's all gonna be sunshine and rainbows you are wrong that has never been the case with these games um, whoa we got prisoners eh what up mm -hmm. 
waving at you through the bars of a cell is a pale, rail-thin man with matted hair and fraying faded clothes. He gives you a lazy, glassy eye grin. Who's been feeding this man? Hey, dudes. Hi. Well, what's up? Like, Never how are you surviving? You Prisoners have to have someone have take care I... of them. We're the Rangers! I'm gonna be saying that a lot. I'm sorry if it's annoying. Actually, no, I'm not. We're the new landlords. We're in charge now. Oh, wow. Wow. Hey, <laughs> new uh, landlords. That's cool, man. Cool. I hope taking over's uh, going good for you. Yep. What, Real good. Uh, what brought you out here? Real good. I don't trust this, ma'am. Mmm. Top secret, bub. Oh, sure. Top secret. So you're part of some important organization. Right. Exactly huh? right. You look like you're uh, real important, you know? I can see it in your pretty eyes. Do you have um, more people in your group? Yep. We, uh, we sure have. That's not something you need to know, though. Oh, so not many then, huh? Don't worry, you'll make new friends. <laughs> it does sound like Cheech, you're right. You, uh, you seem real friendly and nice. So, hey, what, uh, what? No more questions. Now we get answers. Oh, yeah, man, of course. It's definitely Cheech. I don't, uh, I don't mind. Ask me whatever. Name, how long have you been here? Why are you in there? Oh, Jesus, we can just kill him. Um, what's your name? My name? Uh, yeah, uh, Ned. What? Ned. Harry. No. Nick. Booger. He can't remember. Dickens. Lyle? Um, uh, something like that. Honestly, I don't, you know, remember. It's been a long time since I thought about that, man. Don't trust been that. a longer time since someone uh, asked me about it. Where? I... I kind of been here for a while. Yeah, who's been keeping you alive? Couldn't tell you, man. Couldn't tell you. Like, there's no windows or clocks in here, you know? Hard to keep track of when the day, uh... When the day starts, or with ends. like a little bit of Macho Man in there. Anyway, a long time, long enough for other groups, uh, other people to come and go. Yeah. How have you survived? You know, man, I uh, I got everything I Wait. need in here to keep on. Oh my God! Please don't tell me he's like. Oh no. Little, uh, little crack in the ceiling over there drips some water. So I just gotta, uh, lick the wall when I'm thirsty. And, uh, you know what they say about dark, damp spaces, man. Mushroom grew there, man. So I added a little self, uh, uh self-made fertilizer. And those mushrooms are growing good. God, you've been living off wall water and mushrooms. Yeah, man. Yeah. Okay. Yum yum. That actually, I'll buy. I'll believe it. I guess. Oh yeah, and uh, bugs when they come by. Buzzy crunchers and climby snappers and skittery two bites no. and running gushers. No. Sometimes roly poppers and hoppy specks. Once a squirmy slurp. What? That was a good day, man. This poor guy. But yeah, mainly mushrooms. Can you tell us about any of the other groups that lived here before us? Yeah, sure. Uh, maybe. Sometimes, like, a guy might come in, but I don't know if he was connected to the guy who came in before him. You know, kinda, kinda hard to keep track of how long it is between visits. Wow. People don't always tell me this what's going guy. on outside. This poor guy. But uh, let me see. 
Last guy who came in to see me was the dead guy. Before him, tired eyes lady. Wow. Before her, the smiling woman. Before that, it's a little fuzzy. Tired. T I'm tired eyes lady. <laughs> uh, I want to hear about all of them, though. Oh, man. That's, uh, that's some wild stuff. Well, tell me, man. I'm here. So a while ago, that dead guy over there came running in here all nervous and uh, freaked out and starts messing with that uh, computer machine over right. there. Mm -hmm. and yeah, then there's this big ass flash of light from the computer machine and he falls down and then all these uh, sirens and flashing lights. Right. It was horrible, man. Right, right, right. Like, it made it really hard to sleep, you know? Mm hmm Then after a while, the alarm stopped, and then, um, well, you came in. That just happened. Then. Oh, I... Uh, so a while ago, so he came that in. dead guy over Nervous there came running in. Yeah, then there's this big ass flash of light from the computer machine and he falls down and then all these uh, sirens and flashing lights. It was horrible, man. I like, thought the refugees said really they triggered the alarm, though. After a while, the alarm stopped. I don't know, and, but tell uh, me about Tired Eyes Lady. Well, well she was, uh, she was a woman dressed all raggedy but uh i'm one to talk on that <laughs> like how does he even have clothes well i don't know anyway she came in here looking sad eyes looked like she hadn't uh, hadn't seen a good night's rest in years we talked um, for a bit and then she left again sometimes i think i can still hear her voice Hope she didn't die and she's haunting me for some reason. Though now that I think about it, I guess I'd be glad for the company, you know? Amazing. Okay. Oh, a real nice lady, man. Had a big old smile on her face the whole time we talked. Just never stopped smiling. Okay, weird. I think she said she was a traitor. Talked about how she had some merchandise to keep here and some people she was going to deal with. Said I wasn't uh, a suitable <laughs> client, which, sure, because uh, I got no money. Well, actually, she said I wouldn't be suitable for her clients, which I thought was a weird way to uh, to say that. Mm-hmm. What do you mean by a little fuzzy? Because he was like, anything before those three is like a little fuzzy. You know, man, it's, um, I've been here a long time, and I, and I ate a lot of mushrooms. C can't always remember mm -hmm. things that happened in the, uh, olden days, but uh, I'll try. There was, and there was, um, there was a gentleman bear the lip licker and uh, the bloody screamers and uh, and the metal fellers and the really white guy and owl uh, owl face oh and the six Amazing. wee men and the lion the six wee men and the lion but uh, yeah hard to remember who came in first and uh, <laughs> Which ones were just a nursery rhyme my grandma told me, so... Uh, yeah... Amazing. Okay, uh, let's ask myself. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, okay. Cool. Why are you a prisoner? Because, uh, the cell door is locked. <laughs> what the hell? Why were, yeah, that's not what we're asking. Why were you put in there? Oh man, didn't you like my joke? Okay, okay, like, well, so a guy I used to be friends with, well, I guess he was more of a 
More of a business partner. He still remembers this, though? Friend, though, too, man. Like, former friend who decided he didn't, uh, want to go split seas anymore. So he, uh, he conked me on the head. And when I woke up, um, I, I was in here. Real bummer, man. How do you like, remember that? Seriously. Why are you in there again? I told you, man. My partner trapped me in here. Thought he was my friend, you know. But uh, but there's something not right about this. Do you want us to let you out? Oh man, yeah. I don't know, man. Yes, I don't know. He gives me very much the major creeps. The major. Mm -mm. Uh, your call on this one, Rangers. But really, I just let nature take its course here, if you know what I mean. I'd, uh, I'd really, really, really like to get out of here. Really. What do we do? Let him out or leave him in? I'm honestly kind of split either way. I'd rather not kill him. But I'm like 50-50 on whether I want to let him out and just see. Or just leave him alone. What do you guys think? He, he gives me... I was starting to regret being a little mean to him at first. Because I thought, oh, I feel sorry for him. But then, like, the way he answered why he's in there, I was like, something doesn't seem right about that. You can't remember what anything was, but you remember vividly, like, what put you in here. I don't know, man. I don't know. <clears throat> He may leave. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, always I'm like, there is a chance he could help us. And he did give me good vibes for the most part. Yeah, is he intentionally creepy? Like, his bad joke? Like, I think he's just always entertaining himself. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna say we'll see what we can do. No promises. I do want to see if I can find a way. I, I wouldn't mind let just letting him out and like just see what he where he goes. I'll think about it. Cool, cool. I, I get it, man. Yeah, no, no pressure, pressure, no pressure. But, See? Uh, He's cool about it. I sure appreciate it. So, uh, so... Just let me look around a little bit, man. Aw, oh, this poor dude's mushrooms. Breakmaster key. I love it. A dog! <gasps> Terminal displays information about the base systems. Everything appears normal for the moment. Check recent activity. Home through the logs, calling agent messages and routine system notifications until you have a list of recent activations. OS wake initiated, wake complete, credentials rejected, credentials accepted, login admin, password admin, loading default, backup generators initialized, <clears throat> automated security lockdown initiated, login required, credentials rejected, rejected, OS station locking out user due to multiple failed login attempts. So. So yeah, someone set off the alarm, tried to shut it down, tried to scan, and it rejected it. Now whether that's because they were I intruders or just because it was, who knows, hacked for some reason, you don't really know. But then the station locked them out, terminal displays information about the, da, 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 um, that's it. Basically, whatever happened recently and set off the alarms. But we fixed that for now. But the refugees said they did that, right? They said not intentionally, so maybe they didn't. Maybe they just think they did. Master Ski, I can let him out. Let's go search around first. Attacking 
object. If your response skills aren't high enough, sometimes brute force will still work. Break down a door, smack a misbehaving computer, or forcefully shut down a power generator. Use the attack option, um, or left control. Yeah, I was doing that with my sniper rifle. Certain objects, such as vault doors or ice walls, may require specific damage types. man i owe you big uh, yeah real big time this won't be the last time you hear from oh, me oh god <laughs> oh god <laughs> sometimes even when it's like like i kind of thought i'm like with all the crazies and stuff like could easily run back to his own home faction and tip them off. But, on the other hand, I don't know that leaving him in there, if he belongs to an enemy faction, leaving him in there as bait, I thought about that as well. Um, I thought if he is dangerous, I'd kind of rather him be out of my base anyway and just deal with the consequences that come if something bad happens. And then, I'll take the chance that maybe it's something good and we'll hope for that. Let's see what his mushrooms, let's take these mushrooms though. You know, I ain't gonna let it go. Savory smelling mushroom. Mm. Could be harmless, could be toxic. About half a mushroom found in the Ranger HQ brig. It has a syrupy sweet smell. It could be harmless. Could be. We're gonna try them. That's the only way you find out if they're good or not. Oh, might have been toxic. It's a fun. Alright. Whoa. Right here we are. where there was a trap. Oh wait, there's also something here, so let's go straight across for now. Yeah. There's still stuff unexplored in this place, so I need to make sure I got it all covered. Oof. Oh wait, that one was locked. Yeah, it was impossible. And then this... What's it require? Explosive level 2. Can I trade out guys then, maybe, and go get someone with an explosives level 2? Look at all this machinery. Or can I just shoot If we it, can maybe? get it all running, this will be a good spot for your armory. Yeah, okay, here, sure. There you go! See? You just gotta blow it up first. That's all. Oh, hello. Yeah, we got a tripwire. Explosives level 4. We're not ready to clear that one just yet, but... I did want to be like, we gotta be able to clear this out a little bit. Trash. Not trash. Loot. I love Major Tomcat!
check recent activity logs for this terminal. All right. Uh, relates to a massive data wipe from several decades ago. Basically the same thing that other computers said. Step away. Okay. Now I'm gonna open this. However, listen, I do know this. If I blow that up, it's gonna damage. And also, that's a grenade box. Now I don't need that right now. But... I'll wait until I- Oh shit, Doc Nails, you're insane. What are you doing, man? You're crazy, man. Get over here. We'll wait till we have someone. Alright. <clears throat> Explored, explore. Oh, wait, is there color? Oh. Actually, let's go out this door real quick and see what's around the corner as well. I'm sorry, guys. I want to fully explore my base and know where I'm at. And it looked like there were buildings over here. Oh, 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 oh. What's that? What is that? Careful, what the hell? What is that? Oh my god, everyone, everyone back up! You're making me nervous. What is that? What? Hot Wheels car? We dug it up? Oh, cool! That's how you travel. I go. down inside this little garage. Wait, uh, 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 wait, uh, uh, wait, wait. Doc, yeah, let's go here. Go right there. There it is. I almost missed that. I thought it was on the bottom floor. Hell yeah. Just a bunch of awesome loot to sell eventually one of these days when I get someone that can sell. That's how we go out that way, but we're not gonna go that way yet. Uh, let's go here. <clears throat> systems at systems active. Greetings, Rangers. Jesus. Oh my god, is it like um <laughs> uh, oh my god, why can't I think of the name of it? The one guy with the talking car. <gasps> A bumper! No, no, bumper, don't run away. Uh, I want to be their friend. Okay, but that one is out that way. What's that? A snow pile. Pee on the snow pile. And that's how you get the yellow snowballs. I'm doing it. Gather yellow snowballs. You're goddamn right. That's right. I did it. That's right. Ooh, let's go loot that. Listen, we gotta, we gotta... Oh, oh, oh. Stop, stop, stop. I literally saved right before I did it, but I couldn't make her stop. Quick save, quick load.
That was so stupid. I detected it. I just couldn't. I tried to. I gotta. How do I pause the game again? I thought it was spacebar, but that's like select all. So I need to before I. Oh my god! Yeah. No! 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 What is it? Not there. I don't understand. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, requires the suitable mini P. I see. Armor crate. All right, we gotta wait. We gotta get an explosives expert. Don't is does Doc? Somebody has it, I think. Somebody has it. Yes. So Doc Nails has it, but he only he only has one. So next time he levels up. Yeah, he needs, we definitely need that. But you just, you can't do everything at once. That's the thing you gotta remember. Like, that's normal. I'm so glad I hit save literally right before. Whoa, cyborg chicken! Let's go tame it. Metal plated electronics have been implanted in this chicken's body. It looks up to you. A sense of loneliness in its eyes. You don't see any other chickens around. Aww. Plunk, she says. And a, he seems embroiled in a fight with a brick. Okay. Can I not? I want him. Hello, Papas. I would like to join you. Oh, he loves me! Hello. <laughs> uh, oof. Oh my god. The problem with having animals, you guys... Listen to me. Who's a good dog? Oh my god. I better not have dismissed Major Tom. That I know. Where is he? Where is everyone? Come over here, guys. I mean, he says he's right there. Oh my god, it's amazing. Major Tom, and listen, Major Tom's pretty good size. Hello, Major Tom. What do you have to say about this? Purr. You deserve a scritch. Yep. Knight Rider, thank you! Currently a glitch. Pause doesn't work on PC. What? Alright. Let's get back to the mission, Ranger. Listen, pause not working on PC is a problem for me. Alright. What did it say? This character what? Ooh, get this loot. Oh yeah. Like that. So that's good. Well, I'm telling you, that's the thing. The, the only thing I hate about having animal companions is sometimes bad things happen, but they don't. I don't care. The, the wasteland may not be all sunshine and rainbows, but the animals go on vacation here. Everyone understand that? It's my stream, my rules. Our animal friends don't die, they go on vacation. <coughs> Alright. Let's freaking go, then. I guess we got all this rats. So, talk to Sheriff Daisy in downtown Colorado Springs. Got it. And that would be straight ahead. Can I get in the Kodiak and go? 
into the car and head to the world map or take the footpath to downtown Colorado Springs since I don't know yet I'm gonna load in and just look at the world map just to look at it I think I'm just gonna take the footpath but I want to look at the world map first but I've not done it exactly Queen's Army Whoa! Well, map done locations. Okay. This is awesome! You get stuck out in the snow, you can call Godzilla's for a tow by left on the radio. Okay. What? This is awesome. I wish that Baldur's Gate 3 did a, the inventory like this, where it's like one universal inventory and they all pull everything from it. You don't need to like make sure a person, like, the person that loots is, you're not constantly having to offload their crap. Also, I think you can hold as much as you want of anything. So, uh, Pupper Upper, oh my god! It's so cute! So, Major Tomcat appears to be, like, I don't know, like, separate. And, like, the generic Puppo is, you know, he's just a, just a Puppo. But I'm, I appear to be able to have both. I was, I'm glad it didn't, like, automatically... Got a trader in here. Let's go in here. This looks promising. So he runs out and starts trying to hose down the damn propane tank. What? No. What the heck is wrong with these frontier men? No idea. Luckily, I stopped him before he got us all killed. Damn it. Jimmy Long Hall. Okay. Even in his old age, this man is impressive. Broad shouldered and thick necked. Where's a he wears his hair and thick white braids. Hey, Jimmy. Glad Jimmy. to see you're okay. See? Dorsey's <laughs> didn't get this far? Nah, they didn't bother with us. They were after folks wearing badges like yours. Yeah. I would have shot those Dorsey's dead if they'd walked in my garage. Haven't seen your friends before. If you folks are looking for help with your vehicle, well, I just might come be. to the right place. Uh, also, which is, <laughs> it looks like you also repair people. This is the Colorado Springs Arapaho Station. 
We got stations all over Colorado, mostly for fixing and supplying our own fleet. Fixing? But we fix vehicles and sell parts to anybody. Cool. All right, I like them. This is good. I'm the manager, Jimmy Longhall. That's Jimmy my Longhall. Crew over there. You need any Ooh, repairs or pop. alterations to your ride? Best crew in the business. All right, all right. Looks like you repair people. Yeah. Oh, that's Doc Parker. Mm. He needed a place to set up his clinic, and we had the space, so. Good thing, too. Those Dorseys hurt a lot of people with that little raid of theirs. We brought as many as we could in here, and Doc's been patching them up as fast as he can. Only got two hands, though. Parker a good doctor? The best in All Colorado right. Springs, no Looks lie. Like he was the Patriarch's personal physician for a while. Mm -hmm. Took care of all the hoity-toits in Broadmoor Heights, too. Kind of pissed us off at the time, actually. Nice Arapaho boy taking care of the hemorrhoids of the hundred families and turning his back on his own people. Came home in the end, though. Remembered who he was and set up his clinic here. So they're not going to want me Been to. serving the him. working people of Colorado Springs ever since. Tell us about your employees. Co-workers, not employees. Oh, that's nice. I only give the orders because I take the orders. Get me? Mm -hmm. Anyway, Fastback's the old one. Been with the station almost as long as I have. Okay. Ranch, the tall fella, thinks he's a heartbreaker, but he's the most sentimental sap you'll ever meet. Okay. And Pacer is our newest recruit. Don't mess with her. She's 10 pounds of attitude in a five pound bag. Hmm. Are you all Arapaho here? At the moment? Yeah, I guess so. Driving and wrenching has kind of become the Arapaho brand. Arapaho. We pride ourselves on being the best mechanics and couriers in the West. Hell yeah. I like these guys. Tell us, tell me about well, the Arapaho. Well, except for those History of us lesson. who run the stations. We mostly live on the road. The people of the convoy, some folks call people us. And we've turned that way of life into a business. Arapaho service stations, Iron Thunder logistics, right Arapaho caravan protection, and so on. While other folks were eating each other in the suburbs or fighting over mansions in Broadmoor Heights, we kept to the wildlands and didn't come back until civilization had reestablished itself. Smart. And when we came back, we came with services people needed. Transportation, protection, <clears throat> yeah. and repair. Been living well ever since. Smart. Do you hire outsiders? Sure we do, if they're good enough. Takes a lot of skills to I be want these better guys on than my an side. Arapaho, though. All right, what do you sell? Anything for your vehicle. Have a look. Let's look. Hell yeah. Let's hope you got another career plan. I give it another three months before Pesa leaves you in the So dust. you can just straight up so sell anything does? that's marked as junk, just which is basically I what it's for. Shame in that. Everything I else. You, that you, said that. you cannot afford this item. What item? I need somebody with a <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, modding ability. I didn't know until my pa told me to go down to this old man's farm. He said he had a few cars we could take. What we didn't expect was 50 VWs in his garden, hanging around like shrubbery in a rich man's home. Damn waste of some I need to take cars. a break real quick and get my breakfast. So my breakfast was amazing. Thank you guys for sitting through that. I appreciate it. Um, I gotta eat and make sure I stay on top of it. But I'm gonna get this coffee up. I'm gonna go get a water. We're gonna hydrate, um, which is really important. Gotta counteract. I listen. I love coffee and I love caffeine, but it dehydrates 
you ever hear of car gardens? So you mean where they grow I'm gonna hydrate, clean this mess up, year? and then come back. Don't and I'm streaming for overtime because Sorry. I've now that I feel like I'm fully prepared and like kind of got over the hump, the initial like old man's beginning hump. It's like okay, now the world is open and do what you want. Didn't expect was and so I'm ready to go do something. But I'll do it in a moment. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make these people. Whoa, I think I should get rid of that, actually. Assault sniper. This sniper. Sell it. Uh-huh. Oh, Make sure you take care of that bike when you get to it. That rust trap? Yeah. Because this was Jimmy Longhall's first car. When it gave up the ghost in the plains, he salvaged Pretty much. the hood. Turn it into this monster you see before. I should have maybe broke those down. I forgot about that too. That's it's okay. Dedication for you. Also to get we'll out of the now. planes. Thank you. You all for your forgot help. that part. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. All right, one moment. Let me go. I got a delivery that I need to go um, pick up out the front door. Um, but I also want to clean up my my, uh, my my space, okay? I actually hate eating uh, at my desk, but I have to if I'm going to stream for six hours or, you know, more. So so I want to keep it clean and whatever, and I'm going to get some water. But I'll be back in just a few minutes, so please don't go anywhere. Hello to all the new people that are here and watching. If this is the first time here, hi, thanks, I appreciate it. I really do. And I'm glad you're here to watch me play a new game, so... Thank you again, and I'll be back in just a couple minutes.
All right, I'm back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Thank you, guys. For your patience, let's do some cool shit. Sorry. I got a Gatorade. Anyway. Let's drink some. I didn't know they existed until my pa told me to go down to this old man's farm. He said he had a few cars we could take. What we didn't expect was 50 well, VWs I want to make friends with them. Garden. That Hanging I know. around like shrubbery in a rich man's home. Damn, we saw some good Dr. cars. Parker. This here's Market Square. No time. The Arapaho Garage is just outside the city gates. My old friend Doc Parker oh, set up a Doc clinic. Oh, this Doc Parker right here? That's what I thought. A linebacker and a lab coat. This doctor is clearly weary, but works feverishly to bandage the bloody head of an unconscious young woman. Okay. Hey, Doc. Quan, hope you won't take offense, but I've got no time for niceties. Dying people take precedence. Understood, brother. Understood. Can we do anything to help? They're in bad shape, and I don't have the time or tools to save them. Okay. Barter. Nope. Can't do any of that. Okay, we can't help. What can we do? Top Doc. Find and return the supplies to Doc Parker at the clinic in downtown Colorado Springs. Okay. Thank you. The things I need most are a suture kit, an injury kit, and a medic pack. I think I have got those that? things. These folks are We've literally dying on us. It's great. Then get started on those patients. Uh, what? Me? First aid one. Oh, okay, I can do it. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Hell yeah. I love Happy Pup. You ever hear of car gardens? You mean where they grow these fine automobiles? What now? Well, I mean, we have the supplies. Finally. Get started on those patients. Okay. Oh, I guess. All right. This woman is almost unconscious. Her body is a nightmare of bruises and welts, but at least she's breathing. The damage is severe, but a treatable, uh, but is treatable with basic tools. You could use one of your med packs to save a life. Why wouldn't stop? Why wouldn't do it? They wouldn't How do I? stop. Oh Why wouldn't they stop? It hurts. I, I don't know. Please I just let me help you. Let me. Let me. I want to help you. Stay right here. Use I no oh god no stop here. You ever hear of car gardens? You mean where they grow these fine automobiles for our personal use? Don't get cute. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I didn't know they existed until my Why isn't this? To oh, to this requires one first farm. aid. I see. Oh no wonder. Here, who is it that has fifty BWs in his garden, hanging around like shrubbery in a rich man's home? Damn, we see some good cars. No, not Professor. Doc. Of course, Doc Nails. Doc Nails, get over here. And you need... Yeah, you have those in your... In so, your pack. long before you were born, Pacer. Look at who's acting like he's all wise and shit. There it is. They wouldn't stop. Why wouldn't they stop? It hurts. It's Please. From the Another old Where? movie. I got What's it. going on? God, it still hurts, but leg. way less than it did. Thank you. You're welcome. Severely injured man. This man doesn't appear to be in much pain, but he's intensely focused on his leg. White bone shears through the skin. He's clearly broken it in several places. I have a stray here. I feel it. Um, this may end poorly for him. You could use one of your injury kits to save Jumped his out life. out of a building to escape the door. injury kit. Didn't Boom. count on the ground. Don't stopping. worry, guys. Doc Nails is on it. My leg. You said Make it. Make sure you take care of that bike uh, when you get to it. Still hurts like a bitch. That rust trap. Maybe what? I'll actually walk because again. This was Jimmy Longhorn. Oh shit! First Badly call. bleeding, man. We should have got him first. The ghost. This man is sitting, clenched teeth in a puddle of his own blood. A hand pressed to his belly. Intestines bulge from between the slats of his fingers. He won't last much longer without help. If you use one of your suture kits on him, you may be able to save his life. <laughs> Bad, is it? Just pretty bad. But let me get this suture kit. I think you'll right? be fine. You should see. The other guy. Add it to the pile. Right. We'll bring it back to Parker along with the rest of the supplies. There you go. We got you, dude. Car garden. Okay. You mean where they closed my wound? Oh. 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 Miss. Don't get Staring cute. at my own guts. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Anyway. I the exhibit. All right, now? Doc. Now what? We've done everything we can for the patients. They should all pull through. Good. Thank you. One sec, though. Okay. I got a stethoscope. Cool. I know I've asked a lot of you. 
and I'm grateful for what you've already done. But I need one more favor. Yeah. You see this girl? She was shot in the head, but there's no exit wound. The bullet's still in there. I need to keep constant watch on her, and I need cleaner, safer facilities to do it. If you let me use the facilities at your HQ, I'll... I'll do anything. Okay. I'll work as your doctor. I'll fucking juggle for you, this Rangers. This is all I wanted. I just need this to This is literally all I wanted. Her. What do you say? This is amazing. Why are we using all our first aid on things, on people? I thought we were savages. Um, because we need them. Because we need them. We were, we were, I, I don't know. I've, I've, I've already changed my loyalty realizing we're like the only rangers left. I mean, I want to save the ones that are alive. I really do. And I'm going to try. But as far as what we're attempting to do, I kind of feel like, like, we're the ones that are left now, you know? It's on us. So we're getting more selfish. But because of that, it makes me want to, I don't know, I like these people running this, running this, this get up here in Colorado Springs. So I want to, oh my goodness. Oh, oh this. Is very cheeky. Yeah. She just came in. Is the Garden of the Gods yet? The Garden of the Gods? I don't think so. The battle with the Dorkies? Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's the Garden of the Gods? Did you pick up the gunslinger girl yet? And her family's been taken hostage? No, none of that. Are you in Colorado Springs? I just got to Colorado Springs. Oh, you and, haven't done it yet. And I'm, I met the Arapo guy, the garage guy, and I'm talking to Doc Parker. I just saved the people in the hospital. You have to, you have to like, first aid each of them. You see how different it is? <laughs> you see how, Shane's been playing this how long did you play yesterday? A few hours. Like, a, yeah, I say like a few hours. And I've been playing since like 7.30. And you haven't done what I did? Nope. Nope. Well, where'd you find a hospital? I went to Colorado Springs first. After I searched yeah. the base. Yeah, that's I did. where I went. <laughs> did you like the robots? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can't even understand. <laughs> <laughs> did you open the room with the, the trap? Do you have someone that can disarm traps? No, well, I had to, I was able to disarm the first trap. That was easy. Up on the top? Yep. And I and we got through, but then the, the next, there, it has a room inside that with an even higher one. And I know if you blow them up, you, you damage what's in the cases as well. Yeah. So I, I'm I waiting. I haven't done any of them. I'm waiting. I don't have anyone that can disarm traps. The very first one, you can shoot some of them. As long as it won't blow up something, like some of the ones that just like block the way. You just, you can shoot. But I have a guy with explosives, but he just has one point. So, I, like, next level up, I'm definitely give, putting both his in that. Because I realize how important it is, so. Well, I made a decision. I, I was asking because when you get to the battle of the Garden of the Gods. I, I read about that. I heard about that. Someone said that. What is yeah, that? Yeah, it's one of the missions you pick up. Did you, the did you tame Major Tomcat? Yeah. Oh, he's the best. Yeah. <laughs> He's the best. But listen, I made a decision in the game that was it broke it made me question my morals. Oh no. <laughs> well, the results did. In the moment I was like Yeah, th this game will do th these types of games will really do that to you. You think you're doing like something right and then it ends up you're like, "Oh god, it's like yeah, it fucks with you." It's I don't even want to tell you cuz I want Don't. Yeah, I no, don't. I'm well, I'm I want to know when you get to it. I will. I'm pressing yeah. forward now. It's up north in Colorado Springs when you you go. Did you see them torturing all the bodies, the frozen bodies up in front of the... You haven't seen it? Where? Right in the center of town. I've just got to Colorado Springs and immediately turned into this garage. Oh. You didn't see the crowd of people? No, I literally just spawned in and went, Arr! like, before I did anything else because I saw there was merchants and so I wanted to try and sell. Oh, but if you keep going, there's merchants up above that are better than those. But I didn't, I only sold the junk. And then I, I was just talking. Did you pick up a barter guy? I, that was one of the guys I picked at the base. I'm, I want to maybe make uh, my character the barter person. Mm. So that she, they're, it's just always with me. Because already her sniper is insane. With like the quirk, the quirk and then the everything else I got with it, it's like her crit is insane. and her... My sniper's cool, but the gunslinger... When you get the gunslinger, she's badass. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god. 
I didn't even see you. I did not even see that, Ty Five. I'm sorry. I've been so zoned in on this game, guys. Also, there's a lot of reading and there's a lot of talking. So if I don't respond as much to um, the chat, that's the only reason why. As you guys know, it depends on the game that I'm playing, of course. In games like this, it's hard to focus. And, uh, and because there's a lot of you guys and you guys are awesome, there's a lot going on in the chat room. And that's good. So... Um, let's see. What did I see? It was a puppy, Type 5, and it was, yes, it was a puppy. <laughs> and then she just ran back off again. She had a toy, and she was like, meh, and like pranced around for a second, and then ran, ran away. She may come back. I'll listen for her. Don't worry. Welcome aboard, Dr. Parker. Thank you. Thank you. You've saved her life. And mine. Need anything before I get my stuff together? Fame increased. Um, do I? We could use medical attention. Of course. Let's have a look. Let's have a look-see. Healed. We're healed! All right, let's go. Good luck. Thank you. Opens the door. Opens the door, opens the door. Jimmy Longhall. Jimmy Longhall is a great name. The convoy went down into a valley and we all looked up to see a sky full of bodies. Now realizing it, we stepped into Godfisher territory. Godfisher. Godfishers are a dime a dozen. What makes this unique is what we saw. Believe it or not, the sky opened up into a mouth and swallowed those corpses whole. That gets Jesse Carter. Oh, you want to talk to mom? Sleep. She's the one in charge. Bobby Carter. Y'all seem nice. But if you got business with the Carters, you should talk to Mama. Okay, I guess we'll just talk to Mama. Wait. Now let's talk to Mama. Grizzled and gnarled as an old oak tree, the round little woman scowls at you from under her scarf, eyes invisible, and a face that has more wrinkles than you skin. You got business with Mama Carter? Uh, yes. Ha! <laughs> No, you don't. Come back when you do. Okay. Until then, scram. All right. Yes. Okay. God, we we got a whole we got a whole gang here. I love it. Come on, you Ferris fiend! Turn, uh, Theodore. Hello there. The name's Theodoric Curie. Theo for friends. Okay. I need to work on these gate hydraulics, but I always have time to answer some questions. If you're here to learn about our wall. Who are you? I am the humble son of scientists. Okay. My mother and father were on a mission to pursue the possibility of cold fusion. Okay. Imagine okay. nuclear reactions at room temperatures making it safe for everyone. Sadly, they are gone, and my efforts to follow their work has been stymied by immediate dangers. Perhaps one day, I'll have the time to devote to such a monumental achievement again. Tell us about the Colorado Springs Wall. It's simply your standard concrete barrier with Tesla-styled electrical nice. deterrence. Not an absolute marvel of what could be done, but sufficient for the task of keeping out enemies. Nice. If we had oil to power the generators, you'd see the glorious effect of thousands mm. of volts of electricity arcing across it deterring would-be attackers from approaching. Such a pity. Okay. Believe me, I understand. Thank you for stopping by, and yep. good luck out there. <laughs> Just a nerdy scientist guy. Back to the wall. Can't do anything for me right now. There's a gas heater. Marshal, Marshal deputy. Patriarch built these walls with his own two hands. That's what they told us okay. in school. Let's go. Let's go show. Oh, this is what she was just talking about. Did you see it true? The Dorseys are holed up in the Garden of the Gods? Oh, and marshals and citizens have been arranged for pickup and for proper burial. Okay. Oh, Mary Milkteeth. Ew! What a name. Welcome to Mary Milkteeth's Morning After Mart. Yeah. If you did some things last night that you wish you hadn't, I got you covered. Oh I can clean you up, sober you up, cure your ills, and get you ready to face the new day. Or maybe you got banged up in the Dorsey raid. I can help with that too. What do you need? 
What's your story? Just a simple humanitarian who saw a niche that needed filling. Now, are you buying or are you talking? All right. Um, what do you have for sale? Remedies for regret, children. Headache pills, hair of the dog, pills for the pox, pills for the pain, and first aid kits for those of you who might have started something you couldn't Uncle finish. Creepy, uh, All puh, guaranteed puh. to fill you Uncle with pep creepy and put pasta. a spring in your step. That's what why we can abbreviated. I get you? All right, I want everything. Here you go, children. Salvation Give me the goods. is at hand. Hmm. So, junk. I think, ooh, old Billy Baru can level up. Good stuff. You have med hypos. <clears throat> How much? Two eighty. <clears throat> One sixty. I gotta get somebody that can do armor mods as well. Ooh, we gotta equip Doc Nails with the stethoscope. Oh, show. At least two, because I, I used one, <clears throat> one on that person. Yeah, I only got two. But we got injury kit, we got a medic pack, we got the regular med hypos. I got eight of those now. Uh, and it's only one of those. How much were these? Life, a true lifesaver, but incorrect dosage can do more harm than good. Used to remove poison. So how much are these? Wait, maybe grab a couple more of those. Just so we have some variety of, like, Things that snake squeezes. Drink to gain melee damage. It's so for oh It's so weird. It gives you this bonus, but I don't like the I don't like the cost. Sixty turns? It's insane. It's too many. Maybe it's not too bad. Maybe I'll try it eventually, but even if you could plug this into something, it's all burnt out. Oh, this is my junk I sold. Nice. All right, we'll save the rest. <clears throat> we'll save the rest. Thanks, Mary Milk Teeth. That's the gross. That's a gross. That's a gross name. Billy, let's level you up, man. Okay. We can go strength. We can go coordination. Like a, I think I'm gonna go strength for now. Yep. And then we'll do skills. Ooh. Yeah, I want that. I gotta be able to get into stuff. It's just too tempting. It's just too tempting. And I've already found a couple things that were lockpicking level 4, so... I'm gonna use that. Confirm. Nothing. <clears throat> More Gatorade. We gotta hydrate. Alright. Taiwan Jones. Stay back. Here, you need me to. Doc, wait. God damn it! Where which, are one the you, which one of you? Which one of you can do explosives? It wasn't him. Back up slowly. It's Doc. Can Doc do it? Oh, 
fish sticks. I'm gonna have to disarm that thing myself. No, no, I got it. Depends I got on it. how fond of your fingers you are, and your arms, and face. We got it. Yeah. Look at that. Let's just keep waiting. No problem. Holy mackerel! Better stay back from my stall. We Those got goddamn it. Dorsey's dropped a landmine under it. Relax, lady. We diffused it. Really? Ooh, That's great she gave news. me fifty-six dollars. A little something for you. Hell yeah. I'm back in business. Back in business, baby. Fragmine. I want that. Welcome to the freshly reopened Welcome. Taiwan Jones's Emporia. You didn't hear this from me, Franz, but word is there's still Dorsey's all around the city waiting to jump innocents such as yourself. Be sure to stock up with me, yeah? Tell us about yourself. Ah, you want to hear about the wide open seas. My trusty vessel. The wild waves crashing the shores. What are you, a pirate? Well, sorry, chums. I'm just here to sell stuff. What would you like? Okay, what's with the ocean puns? I have no idea what you're talking about, Franz. Okay. Nope. No, wish that I did, Franz. Born and raised in Colorado <laughs> Springs. Me? I've never even seen a fish in my life. Wondrous creatures, I hear. Uh, can we see your wares? Sardine Lee. I don't, she's weird. You're weird. I'd do an RJ City and just be like, ooh, you're weird. Uh, ooh. Left shit. Scout rifle, ooh. How much is it? I want. I want. Uh, I can't afford. <laughs> All right, what about Billy? Can you get a an upgraded melee weapon, please. Bladed blunt. Ooh, look at that bone crusher. Let's get that. How much does it cost? Nice. Two thirty. Can I afford it though? Oh, I can. Billy Baru deser deserves this. He deserves this. Okay. Thank you. Oh, yeah. You... Hey, you chums! Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium! My store, Sardinely. Sardinely. Can I break them down, actually? Filled strip. Oh, I can't until I get someone that can do the field stripping. Okay. Hey, you chums! Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium! Yeah, yeah, yeah. My store, Sardine Lee. Oh my god. I'm never coming back to you, Taiwan Jones, after this interaction. I'm gonna keep that just for now. The brawling, the nooks. I like them. Nobody wants to buy yellow snowballs. What? That's crazy. Markets. What ammo does my sniper rifle use? Ammo ca capacity. Yes, yeah, okay, which is where? There. 34. Not a ton. Not a ton. All right. Fine. One more time, Taiwan Jones. Hey, Jones. But you're Welcome annoying. Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium, Sardine Lee. I had to see what type of ammo my weapon required, and now I know. Right there. Uh -huh. Is 
much as I can afford. So, Shirk gets the ammo. Billy Baru got the um, the weapon, and then everybody got med supplies, the basics. Gianni, what's up, dude? Thank you so much. A small tribute for the first 20k subs. Thank you. Um, congrats, keep it up. And hello, hoodlums. That's what I've been saying all day, man. I'm glad you're lurking. Thank you, Gianni, for being um, so nice, man. I appreciate that. You've always been such a big supporter. Um, we love having you in the chat room. We love it when you lurk, and that goes for all the lurkers. I kind of feel like anyone that's a subscriber that's watch watching is basically a lurker as well. I mean, really, that is it, right? They just watch all the time but don't chat. Like, you guys count too, okay? So, thank you. That's what the majority of that uh, 20K are those people. You know what I'm saying? So, not that I don't appreciate my members. I do. I love you guys. That's why I've been trying to say... That's why I've been trying to apologize for not... If I'm not uh, catching everything in the chat today. Also, some stuff is just, like, too much to answer when there's, like, so much dialogue happening and I don't like talking over the game. Um, or at least I try to pick and choose when I do, so... That's all. So thank you for understanding, everyone. And thank you again, Gianni. Let's praise the sun up. Ooh! I did... Oh! I did upper body yesterday, guys. And my chest is sore. Oh! Ooh! Oh, I cannot wait. Oh, to roll later. It's gonna feel amazing. Alright, let's go. We're good. We're pretty much broke now, though. Night, night club guard. What am I doing down here again? Talk to Sheriff Daisy. Where, where's Sheriff Daisy? Market Square. That was the garage. We still go this way. Garden of the Gods. That's what Shana was just talking about. basically. Sounds Lux. Sounds fancy. Ooh, I don't like when the game auto saves. Oh, man. Hey, take a look at what these marshals and Dorsey's got on them. Marshals? Fat stamps. We got guns and ammo now. Guns? We don't take orders from Marshus no more. Oh my god. Oh! Don't you piss off, Major Tomcat! Waiting orders. Oh shit! Oh god, no! We are, uh oh. They are outnumbering. They are. Wait a minute. Alright, alright, alright. <gasps> I swear to God, if they They've go spotted away. us. Animals don't die, they go on vacation, everyone. We know that. Um, Billy Baru, please go first and just smack this guy right in the face. Shit, now lie down! Such shit, dude. Then let's do this. Where's my grenades at? I know I got one. Who's got it? Who's who's got the grenade? Uh huh. Doc nails. They got the jump on me. 
They did not have the last word. Okay, loot everything. a fun encounter. Hey, yard sale's over. Nice high five. The music is so good. banana. That's very sad. Corpse. Bob is a merchant, huh? We'll come back to see what he has. Let's go in here. Whoa. Surely there will be traps. Animated anim animatron animatronic. Cybernetic Limbs. Um, this is where the legendary Battle of Pumpkin Center, where the Patriarch defeated the savage warlords of the Eastern Plains once and for all. The original authentic treaty that united the hunter families under the Patriarch's rule for the safety of the people of Colorado. Okay, so this is like the American History Museum, basically. But for, for this part of Colorado right now. A can of baked beans from the bunker where the Patriarch's family waited out the deluge of fire. What's this? Yeah, this whole place. Las estas. A mechanical eagle in red, white, and blue atop a uh, and a top hat. Why, hello there. My name's Old Baldy, and this here is the Saul Buchanan Colorado Heritage Museum. Or, as I like to call it, home. Me and my friends here are dedicated telling the story of old Saul Buchanan and the refounding of the great state of Colorado, which is just the first step in Saul's plan to bring back the good old United States of America. Now, just uh, stroll from stage to stage, and we'll tell you the story along the way. It's as simple as that. Any questions before you go? No, I'm good, man. Actually, are you... Are you the American Eagle? Look just like my picture, don't I? Ah, wait a minute. Let me give you my good side. Oh my god. There you go. I gotta admit, though, I'm looking better than I was. Okay. <laughs> Life's been pretty tough on old Baldy since the world went to pot. Lost a lot of feathers. Well, I don't want to spoil the Buchanan show, is but the... it begins with Saul's humble start oh, puppy. in this very town. And it follows the trials and tribulations he faced uniting the hundred families. And, in case you were worried, it's suitable for children of all ages. Oh, great. Animal Whisperer. Oh my god, pet the eagle. Stop. Step back. It is against museum... I, was, I didn't think it would work because he's a mechanical animal. Displays. Sorry. Saul Buchanan I'd say somebody is far was getting ready to go on a scooter ride. Such egotistical shenanigans. 
No, sir. It was the hundred families who built this place as a gracious thank you to the patriarch for all he's done for them. Right. Great. Then on with the show. Yeah, the this the storytelling in this Youngest game is good. Of the Buchanan clan. Brave survivors of the fall of man. Baby Saul grew really straight happens. like a tree, could swing a sledgehammer before he was three. Hmm. I don't trust. So good, so detailed. Dine like kings. He said that the only way to save the land was to bury. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Saul's a hero. Then came the gangs of the eastern plains, hoping to rob us of our worldly gain. Oh, Saul saw him coming and he rolled up his sleeves. He said, You're all nothing but a pack of thieves. Strong as an ox at three score ten. All right. Oh, wait. Mechanic. Damn. We can't get in there until we Colorado an endless peace is becoming a man oh boy what a man the truest of See, I don't like this hero worship of this you could say that again Buchanan guy oh my goodness all right oh Jesus what's going on out here what's that She being cheeky? Snap it, What's going on out standing. there? Dorsey's or no Dorsey's? You think a little raid would stop snapping Jimmy Bob? No siree. Oh, hey. New faces? Let me know if you need to restock. I hear there's still some Dorsey's in the city. <laughs> What's your story, That's Jimmy Bob? Snapping, Jimmy Bob, thank you. Not that much to tell. My dad was a traitor and a good one. And now I'm a traitor and a good one. Oh, that's my prized possession. A genuine pre-apocalypse fully functional microwave. I can cook up some what truly the world is going on out there. What is happening? She's being cheeky. Oh, no! Uh, no! No! It's an Azuka! It worked! She worked all the way across this room! <laughs> That's what she's going crazy yeah. about. Do it again. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's amazing. Oh my god. <laughs> we used to have one. We used to have one in the, in the, at the arcade I worked at, and we would sit behind the prize booth and, like, Shoot customers way over there and then be like, no. <laughs> it, it, the range on it is so far. It's like weirdly accurate. Let me see. Let me see. Oh! Get higher, higher. Make my hair go. Oh! <laughs> the higher. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, well, that explains everything. Yeah, she hates. Yep, that makes sense. <laughs> Ty Five says we're all children. Yeah, I just bought this. It came with the Amazon package. Uh, that's what all those packages were. Whew. Well, that was fun. Ooh, this one's way better. Please use the same ammo. It does. Good, good. Chest armor. It doesn't have any. Now you do. Now you do. You're good. What's that? What? What's that do?
shop, Ranger HQ. Okay, wait. Back up. Oh boy, oh boy. Martha, why Gold else darn it. I even keep a shotgun around if and I don't use it? Do you know who those outlaws are, Josiah? Come, oh. Sarnet. You Dorsey Peckerheads, get on out of there. Peckerhead. Hush up now, Josiah. You That's can't go in insult. there alone. They'll kill you. You're a children. You think I can't handle myself? I've put down worse than these in my time. Oh, since oh, when? You've been a shopkeeper all your life. Will you help me talk some sense into this old fool? If he goes after those Dorseys, he'll get himself yeah, yeah, yeah. killed. Some of those Dorsey bastards are hiding out oh, in we'll my shop. Oh, we'll get him. Don't worry. My shop. Finest clothing store in the whole dang town. So I'm going in after him. Why don't you ask the marshals for help? Well, look, just let us professionals handle this. Thank you. Killing myself? You do this, you'll get a nice discount at the shop. Save. Assuming I still I have a shop by the time it's all over. Save. Okay, Billy. You're gonna get this one, Billy. Watch. Can I throw a throw a, do I have a grenade or something that could explode? Usable, consumable. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, we don't have anything. We don't have anything. Ooh, except them yellow snowballs. What a, what a hilarious way to start. To start the battle. Get him. Yeah! Oh boy. Just like almost, I, I'm, I'm telling you, she's gonna be OP. In a good way. Dark nails, get in here. The 
stink! You got the stink. Now what? Now what? Oh yeah, you're done for. Out of range. Who's out of range? You're out of range. Not enough AP. What? I don't like, I want my animals to stay in the back. I'm scared for them. <laughs> they make me scared, okay? Oh, we, see, God damn it, big block level five. It's infuriating. Blowing safe is gonna drive me insane. Mannequin? Hey, you good looking. Don't be weird. Uh, I'm trying to r rescue it for this guy anyway. Maybe it's better if I don't show up with. Oh my goodness, was that a puppy? If I don't show up. And be like, I don't know, there was nothing in the safe. <laughs> you know what I mean? Everyone's going to get a reward. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, okay, that's not good. Oh my goodness. Let me switch the camera so everybody. Oh, 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 oh. Let me just switch. Let me just switch. A little puppy. A little puppy. It's chill. It's time for a puppy mission. Yeah. We must be very careful not to disturb her and just enjoy. And I have to talk softly and only to her, only to this baby, because she's the only thing that matters right now, right? Right. Oh, she's so precious. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, a little belch. You had a little belch. 
This puppy's doing very well. Oh my goodness. No, 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 please don't go. Please stay with me. Stay with me. I'll hold you up, honey. Can I have a kiss? Come here. Oh, thank you. I love this puppy. I love this puppy. When puppy is done, she gone. Yes, she is. Okay, but that's just the way it works. It's the trade-off. Got it? It's worth it. I think it's worth it. All right, back to what we were doing. We can tell this guy his uh, his shop is pretty clear, I think. I think we got it. And then perhaps he'll reward us. Yeah, him alone, they he probably would have been screwed. Phew, boy. Phew, Thanks boy. again for taking care of those Dorseys. You got you. Look at my happy pupper. We'll clean up the old store and make it good as new. Pretty soon we'll be selling suits, pants, hats, and all the rest. Finest garments in town. And here, a little token of our appreciation. Thank you. Come on back after we reopen the shop. All right, it'll be worth it. It'll be worth it. Save. Hell yeah. Face is nervous but determined. He stepped forward as you approach, holding his By hand order up. of the Patriarch, only authorized personnel are to pass this gate. What kind of authorization do we need? An invitation from the head of a family or authorization from the Patriarch. Until you have that, all right. the gates to. Uh, the attack on the city has everyone nervous. Until that's all settled down, Patriarch's orders are in effect. Authorized business only. Rodmore Heights and the Patriarch's Palace. Good day. Okay. Extra, extra, cowardly attack on Colorado Springs. New in town? Did you hear about what happened? What happened? Sure has. Dorsey's got into the city, but nobody knows how. They started shooting up the place and killed a lot of people. It took a while, but Sheriff Daisy and the Marshals beat him back. Now they're holed up in the Garden of the Gods. Well, some of them, anyway. Others jumped in their trucks and ran for it. Should she want to? Oh, why is it? Oh, because the air. That's fine. It's a fine. Just what I've been told. Back before I was born, they were the family that betrayed the patriarch. And tr thing is, everybody thought they'd been dead for years. I mean, there's tons of stories about how the patriarch wiped them all Sheriff out. I think it's Daisy. Oh, Marshall Station, right over there. You can't miss the pillories out front. Great. Yep. 
I work for the Colorado Patriot, only newspaper left in America. We tell people what's happening in the city and what they... Be careful. Might still be Dorsey's hiding out in the city. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, no. This is what we were talking about. I hope you die slow. Jesus. I How does it feel now? Bodies of Dorsey slain in the recent incursion were tossed haphazardly into this I hope you mountain. die slow. Yeah. How does it feel now? Murderers! Murderers! Marshals, do you work for the Patriarch? No. Then, Judge Watkins has sentenced my son to die. He's a good boy. He never hurt anyone. I don't even know why he was rounded up. If you talk to him, maybe he'll tell you what happened. Sometimes Which one is Austin Pees, the skinny boy up on oh, the platform. Jesus. I can't imagine he killed... Our family escaped the wars in the East. Tried to make our way across the plains. My husband, father's son, my daughters. No. One by one, please. All right, all right. Skinny, help skinny my one. son. Murderers! Darcy scum! Austin, teenage prisoners, gaunt and pale, his hairs tussled, greasy, his face is angular with hunger. He stares at the pillories with dread, swallowing occasionally. Sorry, I, I didn't. I, I didn't mean to ignore you. Just got a lot, a, a lot on my mind. How'd you get into trouble? Made a real big mistake. See, the Plains gangs chased my mom and me off our land. We lost everything. Right, right, right. Heard this? I talked to her. People mm -hmm. here kept us out in the cold. I figured what was the harm. I never killed no one, but I did bust some windows. Okay. Marshals caught me doing it. Ah. And they said I was working with the door. We were starving. No two ways about it. We were going to die. Okay. Dorsey's gave us food. I thought it was too harsh, but what happens if I speak up now? Will they come after my mom? What's your sentence? I Wait, let's say chance. I can free you. What's that worth to you, kid? The magistrate's a hard man. I wish I could believe it at work. I guess I don't have any money to give you, but I I'd pay you back in hard work, if you'll have me. All right, what's your useful skills? I'm used to hard work around the homestead, and I ain't too bad with a gun either. My folks made sure I could hunt and fight. Oh, hello. I thought someone might come back. I thought someone might come back. Fine. She's literally just close enough for me to reach out and pet her and scratch her butt. Well, that's what you get. Because you deserve it. You are a precious puppy. Yes, you are. I always dreamed of coming to the big city and being a newspaper man. You know, interviewing people. Telling the truth about how things really are. Sure didn't turn out like no. I was never no desperado. Don't rightly know why I let myself get caught up in this. But if I'm to die, I'd at least like to do that right. Gonna do that like a man. I don't know, man. Magistrate tells me it's I wonder if it'll hurt. Wish I could tell you it won't, kid. But that'd be a lie. Great. All right. Nice talking to you. Let me see if I can, if I can talk to... The man in charge here. I, I get the feeling I he can be a companion. And if that's the case, I want at least the option. So let me go Dorsey check. Scum! Talk to him. The dour man. Okay, okay, sorry. Back to petting. Yes, yes. Howdy, Judge. How's your heart? It's Marshal Kwan. Impertinent as ever, I see. Rangers, I am Magistrate Silas Watkins. I have heard of your arrival. Partly from the confessions of the Dorsey Raiders, you'll be pleased to know that I sentenced them to death for their part in the attack on the us. They are the only instrument of justice we need. Serious offenders die by exposure. Sometimes I might grant a reprieve after frostbiters claim their extremities. You have no other punishments here? For some offenses, we have a work camp on the plane. Mm -hmm. I don't approve of their methods, okay. but it's outside. Minor Slavery, infractions, basically. like 
public drunkenness or disorderly conduct are punished by proceed. His crimes are still severe. He was part of the Dorsey uprising. He caused I don't know about that, man. Seems damage. a little much. His actions diverted marshals from responding to reports what are his of damages? attacks. You wish to compensate the city and the owners of the damaged properties for their losses. That's the price in Colorado dollars. Heim. This kid better be worth it. This is irregular, but it is within my powers to grant See? you full See? custody of Austin. See, Peace. I'm getting in with the refugees, guys. I'm Any telling you, it's going to pay off. Any further he gonna may commit off. are the ranger's responsibility. I had a feeling I wanted to save him. I would recommend you should inform the boy. Murderers! Best he hears the good news from you. Still here. Boy. Not looking forward to what comes next. You're free. What? Are you serious? You really saved my life and, Fame and, and I get to be a ranger? Yeah. Soon as they let me free. Oh, uh, thank you. Th no, no. Thank you. you thank you. you. Murderers! Thanks, Rangers. Can't wait to get out of here. Okay. Bastards! Thanks, Rangers. Okay, can't I guess maybe I can't get him right right now. Alright, let's go talk to his mom and tell her the good news. How does it feel now? Oops. Bastards! <laughs> I'm gonna tell Dorsey Scum! For my son. All right. Thank Dorsey you. Scum! Thank okay, okay. You. I'm en enough of the people yelling. It's too much. Hey, How refugee. Does it feel now? Come here. Murderers! Murderers! The Russians raided our farm. Allie? Mom? Mom? Are you? Whoa. Oh, sorry. Never Can mind. Can we talk? What? Why? What do you want? No, please, I just need you to go away. Please. You were expecting your mother. I, I don't know. We were heading to Colorado Springs with a lot of other folks when we... Uh, I hurried here as quick as I could after, but... Out there, there was this smiling lady. A smiling she she lady? She had some food. And oh, I could no. take some back to my mom if I could... She was gonna sell me. Oh. She put me in a... Cage. Remember the prisoner that was talking about the smiling lady? One of her men took me out. I kicked him as hard as I could. Hell yeah. They didn't find me in the dark. And then I saw some refugees and stayed with them till I got here. Uh, yeah. Bye. Murderers! Yeah. I hope you die. Tent? I hope you die slow! Murderers! Ranger HQ. Murderers! Murderers! <laughs> Dorsey scum! Wait, come here. Murderers! That's over here. Hey, Bastards. Rangers! How'd Rangers. you like that welcome party at the lake? Wait, is this guy talking shit? No regret! No real pals! Death to you can no mercy on the deluge of blood! Cornelius Dorsey lives! He'll kill you all! We ain't gonna beg for our All right. lives. Everyone? No, no. Can I go pick up the kid, though? Or should I... Hillary Square, Marshall Station. Let's go on in to the Marshall Station, I guess. First. We'll have our revenge. I hope you die slow. You ain't seen the last no great Can we just kill them already? No great vengeance. I hope you die it's slow. Too old to fight the Dorseys, they said. Ha. I hope you die slow. M must be Dorsey's drunker than I thought. Did someone yell something about Dorseys? Oh, you like? What are you doing? You wanna lay there? Okay. Billy Baru, please pick the lock.
Oh my god. Ah! Someone's getting beat up. Oh, it's just a door. Someone let him into town. <gasps> Marshals! Finally! I was beginning to think you were never going to help. Who are Hold you? on now. You aren't Marshals. You look like ruffians. Mm -hmm. Are you here to see the sheriff? Well, I'm first. I've been waiting oh here on tenterhooks for an hour. Okay, Karen. Ruffians. I... I am under considerable duress. My family has been kidnapped by those no-good Dorseys, and I oh, must okay. know how the sheriff intends to rescue them. Um, the marshals seem a bit and overwhelmed what at that the may be, but my family is one of the leading families of Colorado Springs. We have... I... I... I suppose not. We are all equal in the eyes of God, as they say. Yeah. Who are you? My name is Lucia Wesson. Daughter of Percival Wesson and Maria Reyes of the Hundred Families. But now they and my little brother have been kidnapped by those good-for-nothing Dorseys. All right, all right, all right. And we are the founding families of Colorado Springs, descended from the survivalists who came together after the deluge of... I'm proud to trace my lineage back before the war on both sides of my family. Someone let the Dorseys yep. into town, and the savages That's have taken my family saying. hostage. Along with a good man, I came here to Garden demand that Sheriff Daisy that. immediately mount an expedition to save them. But her mar- No good traitors, that's what they are. Used to be hundred families, like us, but rotten. Backstabbers, every one of them. They rebelled against the patriarch before I was born, and okay. were driven from the city. I was always told they were dead and gone. It seems I was misinformed. We'll talk to the Sheriff. Thank you, friends. Sheriff Daisy, I will not leave until you speak to me. Miss West, Miss Wesson, could you? Sorry about that. Are you? Thanks, Torres. Anytime, Marshal Quan. What you working on? Any advice on how to handle Sheriff Daisy? <laughs> Don't blink. Reports: the Dorsey raid really. Tore up the town. Murder, looting, fires. They even attacked this station. Not that they got very far. It's on the back of the box. We keep the peace here in Colorado Springs. Mostly, though, we do what Sheriff Daisy says. Thanks. Right, if you've got any feedback, be sure to fill out a form. What kind of a name is Sheriff Daisy? A coffee maker's. Ooh. Marshals must go through a bunker's worth of coffee every day. Yeah, where do they get that from? That's what I want to know. All right. Sheriff Daisy, we're here to talk. The sheriff is a statuesque woman with graying blonde hair and steel in her smile. Well, now you must be the rangers. I like her already. I'm the sheriff around here, but you can call me Daisy. Old Saul tells me you're a bunch of badasses. I'll take and it. I ain't one to turn away a badass. Especially at a time like this. I, I reckon you already heard all about the Dorsey raid. Yep. So I won't bore you with the details. So the thing is, I lost a lot of marshals. My boys and girls are tired and beat up. And by speak, you mean shoot the everlasting shit out of them and save those hostages, right, boss? Quan. I hear you're some fancy liaison now. Nice, Queens. Old Saul taking my people without even asking. That is some sisterly How love. How dare he. Anyway, yes, you rascal. That's exactly what I... Ma'am, yes, ma'am. All right. Lucia Weston wants to talk to you about rescuing her family. That girl? You think I ain't heard her yap? Tell you what, though. Her people are hundred family folks from the fancy side of town, so they got some pull. 
You can do me a big favor. No, don't make me take her. Kill two birds with one stone if you take little Miss Wesson with you when you go to save them. In fact, I'm going to insist on it. I need that girl out of my hair. I'll let Lipinski know you're bringing her along. He won't let you into the garden without her. Oh, my God. Amazing. Don't worry. Go in there and kick some ass, Rangers. Oh, God. Fine. The garden's on the far side of the market Come square. on, Lucia. Don't you forget to take Miss Wesson. You spoke to Sheriff Daisy like you promised, strangers. Thank you. Let's I, talk about combat experience. I heard... Certainly. My father taught me to shoot almost before I could walk, and I'm the best shot in the city. Oh, it's true. She's a prodigy, all right. All right. Have you also ever killed anyone? I... Yeah, that's no. what I thought. That's what I thought. But I have hunted. Did I leave my Gatorade? I did. There's no need to worry that I will be shy about pulling the trigger. Oh, no, I promise, man. strangers, if it is to save my family, I will not hesitate. All right, let's go. At last. And we got her. Okay. Can she wear anything? Nope, her revolver is better. Let's see, can you wear anything? Nope. And then let's also throw a, put a grenade on her there, just in case. All right, fine, she's a gunslinger, whatever. Small arms, weapons modding though. Can we? Excuse you. Oh, yes. Hey, hey, you can just stop. Ooh, little plastic nubs actually make it easier. Hit chance plus three. Do it. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, looks like there might be some. No, no, nothing. Definitely moddable, but I just don't have the stuff right now. Okay, cool. Well, she's useful, that's for sure. Weapons modding, barter. There's my barter. There's my survival. Man, maybe she's. A of course, they'd make her. Really useful. All right, we're a party now. Let's go. No repenters, no repentance. Garden of the Gods is just north of Market Square. Marshal Lupinski should be out front. Hi, y'all! Name's Snappin' Jim. Let's. He's still less annoying than the other chick. Like 100% honest. Not a bad, like, they're pretty cool, actually. Weapon mod. Ooh. different sweet
by that scope and let's see if I can put it on my sniper rifle. Yeah. Confirm. Cool. All together now. some new arrivals wash on in. Military types, they so much as I'd love to shoot the shit with you tryhards. Yep. Sheriff Daisy said to let you go on in. Let's go on in. So, go on. We're Give them here. Dorsey some hell. Give them hell. Gonna be a good thing to Marshal do. Lupinski, I expect you to moderate your language in the presence of a young lady. My oh apologies, Miss West. I meant no disrespect. Any idea? Nope. It's the Garden of the Gods. Rocks. Exp no right. room for amateurs in this town. You hear? No room. Yep. That's what you said. It's game say, let's go in. Come on, everybody. Yep. We're going. The Waste Wolf is a savage predator found all over the wasteland. Look at that art. That's cool. I gotta make a good thumbnail for this game now that I'm playing it. Chicken? Whoever just came up from the city, come in. What? This is Bellamy Ward. I... There are Dorsey's all over the garden. I pinned down on a high ledge. Can, can you reach me? All right, no promises, but we're planning to kill every Dorsey we find. Oh, thank God. I'll call out if I see you. Hundred as families long reputation, as it's safe. plus one. Hey, you on the ledge? Hands up! What up, TJ? Oh no, <sighs> they found me. Oh shit. Hello, chicken. <laughs> I already have an animal follower. Garden Spire. Ice block. What's that do? Oh, no! What happened? I'd like to maybe put it like here, and then we can run up the side. Like I can have that way it gives uh, Billy Baru a, a, a way to get close without necessarily getting exposed. What? No, 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 no! I want you to throw these. Here. Invalid. There it 
this. That's as far as it goes. Perfect. He can still get close. He can still go up this side angle here. Literally pelting them with, with yellow snowballs before battle begins. Alright, let's see ya. leg. We gotta fix that. I can't. Nice! He's got freeze burn. That is good shit right there. Uh, can you... 51%... 90. Let's finish this down. A miss! Come on, 
My turn. I am losing a, a significant amount of blood. Hang on, Professor Higgs. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, skull nukes. Oh, blood nice. for blood. Animal soup one out. Good. All right, Billy. We saved you, dude. Oh, God. Did the Patriarch send you? Oh, I'm no. sorry. I'm sorry. I, I need... Bellamy. Bellamy, look at me. Have you seen my family? Lucia? I... I thought you were with your family. Oh, thank God you're not. Thank God. They went up ahead with their hostages. Okay, if okay. they've done anything to... Please okay, do. Okay, okay. I'll tell whatever I can to help. Okay, okay. It's Who not are you? Much, what are you doing here? My name is Bellamy Ward. I'm a scientist. Okay. I invented the solar collectors oh. and experimental farms on top of the rock. I was calibrating the solar arrays when the Dorseys came through here. They're savages. Yeah, we know, we know, we know. Animals. They beat those people. God, no, I was stalling for time. If I had a few hours and the right chemicals, though, I could have prepared quite a surprise for them. What's the material? A while ago, we found some old, non-functional solar panels from before the deluge of fire. I couldn't figure out their function at first until I recovered a micro-circuitry board and developed a laser spectrography process. Right, right. I realized... Anyway, where are the hostages? they took everyone to their camp, just past the Gateway Rocks. What about my family, Belle? Major Tomcat didn't take a single hit, hit that entire time, Ty-5, so that was literally just his attack noise. Last I saw them, they were all right. They were skiff alive. We don't have a mechanic, which it. makes me sad. Alright. Bloop, 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 bloop. Get up, just a higgs. Get up, duck nails. Perk point. Ooh, okay. Let's just go ahead and see then. Uh, starting at level four, your rangers will earn a perk point every other level. Perk points are used to unlock powerful abilities, passive bonuses. Perks become available as you learn and upgrade your skills. Okay. Non skilled perk points. Deep pockets. Healthy, hardened. Quick reflexes. Crit resistance. Sniper rifle. Oof. Mark target, which is just so handy when used correctly. Animals gain bonus to con and damage. Yep, that's my choice. Animal Whisperer level four is a huge jump to their damage, which is exciting. Uh, a 
and then sneaky shit level three. Disarm alarms. Yeah, let's do sneaky shit level four, actually. There we go. Confirm. Oh, I wasn't done. Awareness. Hit chance. Or intelligence for crit chance. Oof. One more and intelli intelligence. One, two, three. Yeah. She's smart. I was done there for a sec. We got you, dude. Doc nails can only be removed by injury kit. Injury kit. Nice Doc save. Nails. Thanks. Where's the injury kit? Ah, oh, nice case bow. Anybody else? Oh. Professor Higgs. Fix him up. Marshall Kwan, same. This is what's great about having a, uh, a medic. Okay, everybody, good job. We're gonna save. Oh, look at that. I did not even check to see what was in the weapon crate. Bell Army. Bell Bellamy. Bell Army. Nobody move, nobody move. All right, those are level two, and we cannot disarm those. Now, if they see them, will they avoid them, or will they still run right into them? I need a mechanic level two. Bella meow. As long as you detect them, they won't run into them, hopefully. Oh, Jesus, never mind. And of course it saved right after I ran into that. That's so dumb.
It literally, like... Yes. I kind of wanted to see. So they will still run into them. So I need to be sure to make my party avoid them. I hate that I can't pause. When shit gets, like... Ugh. I don't like that. It makes me very nervous. Ready, ready? Right here. Got him. Boom. Oh, he is a tough guy. He's very, very tough. I was like, oh, he's got a special. I thought it would let me select who I wanted to do it, but he just swings it and it damaged him and my guy. Which I was like, I, under I understood that it would also damage him, but I thought I would try to swing on that other dude. That's annoying. That was my bad. That's like the other day when I was telling you guys about Baldur's Gate, how like just not knowing the controls yet is gonna make things difficult initially. I don't know if I'll get a good, as good a shot as I did that first time, though. Maybe.
good. Good. Marshall? I can hit this guy. <laughs> Jesus. I got Billy on that. My bad, Billy. Shirk has a position. Let's use it on the Beastmaster himself. Headshot. Oh my god, he's tough. Definitely tough. Um, Temperature's going to sell him. It's its own kind! Yes! Oh, not enough AP! Come on! All that, Doc. What are you doing all the way back here, Professor Higgs? See, this is why I, I fucked this battle up because. didn't even have my people in place. Like, these guys were back here. I didn't even, like, that sucks. They're here! And full of blood! Out of range, out of range. Bullshit. My turn. Here, just finish this guy. See us hopping off. Finished him. So cold. Where's the fire? Yep. The one I charmed is fighting for us. Good shit. I 
might. Oh damn, Shirk is dead. I mean, not dead. They they get downed in combat, and then if you can finish combat, you can like fix them. They come with like, they have injuries and stuff that you have to heal. Like it's not like it's whatever, but like there's, there's no permadeath. Still breathing. That's pigs. Still fighting for us. Come on. Watch out, Pupper. You're fine. Professor Higgs, can you let's consolidate our efforts? Revive him. Yep. we go crit baby all right lucy is really good shit get up professor higgs your turn to get up now man Got a shattered shoulder, oh no. Uh oh, Billy Baru's dead up there. We gotta help him too. Uh oh, out of ammo! Jesus. Checking. 
I like the sound of like, yeah, like in my ears, the, the thing going off. There it is. start this one but I did it at a disadvantage I feel like with a clean start I should be fine oh shit actually oh my god look at that we got all of us boom 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 just dropped my pupper's the only one up still fighting we're gonna reload so I was like down two people from the start and still almost won that so please keep in mind I'm playing on hard and and this is the first time I'm playing it. So I'm actually not too upset about that. That went pretty well, actually. This might be a good place to use some of my other um, stuff as well. Alright, sure. That's a good spot for you. Go see what's in the booze box. All right, Shirk, you are gonna take the first shot. Turns, but gain evasion afterwards. I don't know, man. Crit. It's just the 
punishment. 720 turns to have minus 10% evasion is insane. Like, I thought 60 turns was bad. For real. Molotov. Ooh. I love it. Perfect. Yep. Here. Make yourself another shot. This is how it no, ends. No, no, Professor. Don't worry. Also, 
defend, please. Okay, please. Uh, you know, they, they are tough. They are tough, tough, tough. I would actually kill one of them, but no. I need to try and drop one of them. The one I've got the best... Yeah, I'm doing the damage to him. You're right. That's the best. Alright. Professor Higgs. You... Ned Hypo the shit out of yourself. Okay. Oh no! What?
animals go. Oh my god, they're awesome. Billy. Billy, can you end this man? No. Get out of the way, Billy. Jerk. Finish this asshole. We did it! And everybody's alive. Everybody. So, when they get downed, right? They lose their health, they drop. If you get to them within a certain amount of time, a certain number of rounds, you... Oh, shit. You can... Everybody's that will healed. do. Thank you. They got no negative effects. Negative effects. Who knows? Who knows what inspired Shane? Although she did say I had mainly Charlie to thank for locating it. God damn. Can't wait to use it. I wonder what I can use it on. Tesla coil, it says. It's too close. I don't want to get blurry. I want you guys to be able to see it. Focus. Focus. Woo! All right. Did we loot anything? Loot everything. Ooh, vehicle upgraded, wolf skull ornaments. Oh, yeah. I love everything. Shirk. You need some pants. go spreading around the, the good the good armor a little bit all right that damage is better hell yeah let's Although, like I learned in that one, it, it might be good to have backup weapons that they can use. Small arms. Yes. Weird laser pistol. Bunker buster. Same thing. Wait. If 
you field strip it, do you get the mods back? This is only one way to find out. Oh, well. All right. Major Tomcat, you good, man? All right. There you go, Type 5. Some happy Major. And look, he's got a blue bandana! Type 5. I'm so scared I'm gonna accidentally click the you could be dismissed Major Tomcat and I really will be, I'll have to reload. What, what's in that pit? Well, let's go maybe find out. Merc helmet, rad tech armor, merc armor. Requires strength four, okay. Billy. Billy is, looks like he gets the good armor. can wear it. He should definitely wear it. Yeah, way better for him to try to stay protected. He's already wearing that one. Yeah. And she's got those. Okay. Whoa. Perfect. Yep. Major Tomcat has a blue bandana on. It's really perfect. All right, let's go see what's in the burning pit of doom. The scent of charred meat and burnt hair wafts from the pit. Smoking bodies contorted by agony or post-mortem muscle contraction lie curled atop one another. Blah. Great. Any sign of your family? No. Can't see a... a thing. I don't know if they're here or not. I can't... Let's examine. Come on. Nah, Let's nah, find nah, the nah. monsters who did this. Let's... That... That was one of the Skylar girls... I think. Seems like we ought to leave her alone. Feels an awful lot like grave robbing. Alright. Well, no, because that might be proof for someone to... Yeah. That might be proof I need for someone. Chicken. Ooh, more Molotovs. Those are nice. Big fan. Pal.
Christ, I forgot it. Oh my God, you don't even know what just happened. I was trying to select her, not shoot her, and I shot Lucia right in the face. God, I gotta get my controls down. This is what happens when we play too many of these games that are similar. Jesus. Yeah, yeah. We know. I'm gonna get my two best shots up close. those Molotovs I just looted. So uh, let's chuck one of these! See how they like that! Huh? Them, but I'm hoping the other will still have to run through it, so it'll be fine. Oh boy. Uh -huh. <laughs> Leave Billy Baru alone! Hell yeah. Dolls, what? Wow, simply collecting them will benefit you for the rest of the game. Cool, the archive, cool. What's it do? Perception plus one. What? 
and 10 shrink grenades? This is... This is great. Oh. I didn't even realize that went right out that way. Okay. Onward! Makes me nervous. On this level of difficulty, you can't turn friendly fire off. It's part of it. It makes you just have to be smarter about how you position people in battle, which I'm okay with, but just I selection wise, I was literally trying to like not do any of that. I just didn't realize I still had the attack button on. And <laughs> I just turned around and shot her right in the face. All right. Am I's agreed. On behalf of all of us here, I want to offer our unconditional surrender. What? As proof of our goodwill, I want to tell you that the culprits got into town with help from Farron Brago's organization, and... and... Isaac, how could you? How could you throw in with these people? How could you let them take my family? Where are my parents and my little brother? They're... They're oh, in the God. grave you passed on the way here. They didn't suffer, Lucia. I promise. Baby, look, I didn't mean it to go this way. Oh my god, dude. I tried to stop them. I. No. Stop talking. Let's kill them. Right now. Wait a minute. You were. You kids were helping the Dorseys. Um, just tell us how those people wound up dead, you piece of shit. You helped them kill Lucia's family, and you want our forgiveness? Yep. Yeah, Not you. forgiveness. We want. It was Melius Dorsey. He went looking for your family, Lucia. Your family, especially. That's why I got. You didn't want anything to happen to me? So you let savages abduct and murder my family. You But you're still alive, Lucia. Don't you see? Whatever. Where you're is still he now? Alive. He escaped. Mm. He took some vehicles and headed west into the mountains. Mm. I don't think he was planning to come back. Why'd you do it, Isaac? We've been under the Patriarch's boot for 50 years. We say that the hundred families are in charge, but it's really just his family. Just him. I know you must think I'm a fuzzy-headed idealist, but this society's sick. It needs to change. Did they have support? Farron Brigo's gang helped them get into town. I don't know how or why. And I overheard Neely. I think... I think she's going to attack Colorado Springs. What the hell? It sounded like she's gathering an army out of... I have heard enough. If your betrayal of my family was not oh, shit, sufficient, she's got her gun out. your treachery here most certainly is. In the name of the Patriarch, I sentence you. Damn! Please, Lucia. I did this This is her boyfriend, you. by the way. All I ever meant was to help build a better world for you. For all of us. I can't tell you how much I regret. Please don't kill me. Go for it. Please. Oh, I'm getting, I'm getting ready to make Lucia murder this guy. Please, All Lucia. No, you. this guy that betrayed Yeah, the... yeah, yeah, her boyfriend. Yeah, yeah. Nope. <laughs> Boom! And they all went, Wee! Whatever. Look at him cowering. Yeah. Gadoosh. And my pupper. Look at my pupper. <laughs> all right. Um, wait. Let him bleed to death. You finished the job, kid. You wanted to take a life, take it. You got to double tap him. Okay. All right. Please, Lucia. Please. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> Amazing. She turns away and is violently sick. You psychos! You killed Isaac! You kill us all! Yeah, you about to all die. Children. I don't care. They're not that young. Yeah, they are. They're children. They're not. They're they're more than old enough to be murderers. They betrayed the whole community. 
Straight up murderers, guys. What makes what makes them any more valuable than Lucia? Nothing. It's bullshit. Winners. We took care of the Dorseys. There are no... Wow. We killed every last Dorsey rat and the hundred families' kids helping them. We took care of the Dorseys. There's no survivors. That's what I'm gonna say. Kick ass, November 1. Glad to hear justice has been done. Over and out. Yeah. Thank you for the medical attention. Marshal Kwan, you got to upgrade, huh? Upgrade. Thank you for the medical attention. I like him being charismatic. Kiss ass, wow. Automatic weapons. Yeah, let's make him even better. Oh, it's different when you're actually playing it, isn't it, Matt? I've tried telling that to people, I'm like, you don't understand. Like, being in the game is different. Same with VR. Woo! 
I do love me some loot. did it guys I wanted to finish this before I wrapped up for today I told you guys I was gonna do overtime I meant it this has been almost an eight-hour day you let me shoot him never shot anybody before today and now I've gone and shot my boyfriend I mean my ex-boyfriend yeah ex in more ways than one I suppose oh god listen I killed him I really killed him. I can't believe he's dead. I can't. Don't blame yourself. Um, you got justice for your family. Isn't that what you wanted? I, I, I did, but was this it? Was Isaac who I should have shot? Yeah. I, I need to find the people who steered Isaac wrong. The people who were really responsible. Neelius, Dorsey, and Liberty Buchanan. Okay. Would you help me find them? Yes, yes. You can count on my guns every step of the way. She's good, yeah. Um, yep. Yes, ma'am, we'll help you. Of course. Good. I You've like got yourselves her. She's a bargain, a Rangers. Hell of a shot. We should go after Neelius Dorsey first. Isaac said he headed west into the mountains. No doubt he plans to hole up at one of the old resorts from before the bomb. I don't yep. think we're ready to face him yet, though. Neelius will be dug in, I expect. And he'll have all his best people with him. I thought she said she was going to follow orders, not give them. Oh, relax, Marshal. For now, we should head back to the sheriff. Relax. How's the family? Shut your hole. I need to slip with my wife. Hey, 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 slow down. I didn't. Hey, Jones. Welcome to Taiwan Jones's Emporium. Sergeant Lee. Got junk. I like it. Flamethrower fuel. <laughs> Savage helmet. Savage. Cool. Alright guys, I'm gonna save it here. Big save, hard save. Let's go. Downtown Colorado Springs. Cool. Alright, hoodlums. Thank you guys for a long day of a lot of fun and a new game. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was Wasteland 3. I'm probably going to be playing it um, uh, the next time I stream. Uh, tomorrow is Sunday. I'm not going to be streaming tomorrow unless it's like we do a BRE stream or something like that. Maybe later in the day. But I will have videos going up. 
I will have a video going up tonight. I will have a video or two even going up tomorrow. If we don't stream, I may put some, one of them out in the evening too. Because I got a bunch backed up that I just need to put out. Um, Serious Sam, Phasmophobia, More Among Us with the BRE and Friends. Um, different games than what we did with Up Up Down Down. And uh, so I, I've got a lot that I want to put out there. So definitely keep an eye on the channel, an eye on the community tab. I also share the videos of my friends who are making videos that I was a part of, whether it was on their stream or whatever. Um, so I feel like there's a lot of entertainment to go around. So I just want to thank you guys for uh, consuming it. And I hope that you continue to. And although I'm not streaming tomorrow, like I said, there should be something going on. But if not, I will see you guys on Monday. I look forward to it. And we will be playing more Wasteland. I may or may not play a little between now and then. I've got a lot to do. So we'll see. I'll see if I can stay away from it for you guys. All right. I'm out of here, hoodlums. Take care. I will see you another day.